want to hear this game anymore. All right. Okay, hello everyone. Hopefully uh, the game works this time now, because, uh, all right, yeah, it looks like it's working correctly. Jesus Christ, man, this was, this was just not working. Okay, I just had it to where it just captured my entire display instead of just the game. Because it's not, it doesn't minimize it, so it should be fine. But, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, welcome to Enter the Dragonfly. I'll have it watch the cutscene and deal with this again. <laughs> it's just a float, you scaredy cat. Uh, they sure do look happy, don't they, Spyro? Well, I just noticed that there's a Ripto pinata in the background, too. And he's just got his face beaten in. Uh, right, Sparks. It's so weird going from Reignited to this. Like, good God. Like, Ripto died, right? He fell in lava and died. And also... Nobody invited the, uh, this is an invitation only party. the plot. Very clever, <laughs> Dragon. You know, you should join me. We would make a great team. What do you want this time, Ripto? <laughs> oh, yeah. he, that, that enemy only didn't even talk. Time, boss. You're not hired for your brains, you dinosaurian land mass. Keep thinking, and I will send you back to the place I found you. Unemployed in Molten Crater, begging for work from Nasty North. Now, back to what I was saying. Once again, well, how would he know? do I want this time? I'm glad how would he know who Nasty North is? And I, will be happy I don't think he's ever known who Since Nasty Nork was. to do with dragons, I thought, perhaps, dragonfly. <laughs> well, that wasn't supposed to happen, but you see, without the power of dragonflies, the dragons are nothing. Soon the dragon homelands will be mine. <laughs> Spyro, that little lizard totally stole all the dragonflies. Even and you guys Sparks just pretty gone. much let them. Spyro, Crunchy, don't worry. I think I know where to start. Follow me. <laughs> the music cue coming in. <laughs> wow. Ellie Sparks is okay Sparks. for some reason. I thought I lost you, pal. That was close, Sparks. Listen, I think I may have figured out a way to catch those dragonflies. Spyro, I don't like that they don't have teeth. They kind of look like sock puppets. Whoa! What'd you do that for? Drat, that didn't exactly work right. I'm still learning, you know, Spyro. The good news is I've created a powerful magic that will enable you to use different breath abilities. The bad news is you're going to have to find dragon runes to use them. Ah, oh, not dragon runes. Parts of the dragon realms. Cool. Come on, Sparks. Let's oh, go. Bring it in the runes from ahead of us if we want to find those dragon rune runes. factory. Do you think we'll ever get a day off? Dude, Hunter looks terrifying. Everybody in this game looks disgusting. <laughs> and I don't think the... Oh, God. I had to overclock the the system here and I had to use an emulator I'm sorry uh, but I had to do the 250% setting because if I didn't uh, she just straight up disappeared uh oh okay she's back this dragon room to the dragon spirit over there with this rune, he'll be able to combine dragon magic with my magic and grant you bubble breath to catch dragonflies. 
They're shy and will probably run away from you anytime you come near them. Great. Tap your L button to switch back and forth between fire and bubble. And bubble breath. Okay, so that's the dragon rune. The camera moves really slow. Also, I know that there's some settings here that I can turn on that's going to be... We're just going to crank this shit up because this shit's super slow. We'll go from there. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's a little bit better. Got it in big mode. I don't... I feel like if I... I'm going to turn... Turn the game down just a smidge. Okay. Let's see how... Honestly, that didn't really... Uh, That didn't really help with the... So... Yeah, now he's gonna explain where the gems come from. Every time the bad guys come, they end up trying to steal the dragon treasure. They always take more than they can carry and drop it all over the place. Pick it up so we can return it to the dragon elders once we're finished. I can even help. Thanks. And then we explain the sheep for some, for some reason. Butterflies are the key to my healthy golden glow. Each time I eat a butterfly, I gain one health point. When I'm gone, butterflies will also bring me back. Flame or charge fodder to get butterflies. So oh, so where exactly do I find these butterfly sparks? And I'm not gonna let him do his little Banjo-Kazooie line. I'm just gonna read it. You don't remember? Sheesh, I thought I had a short memory. Okay, all you have to do is charge or flame one of the small animals running around. When you do, poof, a butterfly appears. Then I'll take care of the rest. <laughs> yep, still Spyro, still... Oh my god. Try charging these baskets or... Yeah, I know. This isn't my first rodeo. Okay, I'm just turning it up in my headphones a little bit. And that... <sighs> With bubble breath, you can catch dragonflies on the loose. If you can get close enough to them, your bubble breath will trap them inside a bubble and send them home thanks to Bianca's magical spell. Just burn them to a crisp. Okay. The magic of this sacred room will bestow upon you the power of death. <laughs> Why does <laughs> Bubble breath. You caught tunes. <laughs> it's tunes. Oh my god. Remember tunes from the other game? Apparently there uh, there's some modders that are working on fixing this game. So doing like updated textures, fixing a lot of the glitches and all that. And you gotta say, hey more power to them if they want to fix this game i'll let them why not good work spyro use the stones to get to the dojo remember spyro find the dragonflies before ripto oof uh, uh, i'm just not i'm just gonna be quiet on that one <laughs> that was a little Oh. I hope that wasn't a white guy doing that voice. It might have been. 
All right, sleepy bear. What's what are you, are you gonna sell me some tea? Spyro, I was dreaming His name of a genie that turned into a nightmare when these horrible Riptox kicked me out of my bed and threw me down this swirly thingy. Maybe the magic of dragonflies will help activate it. Oh, maybe. 25 dragonflies. Oh my god. Alright, yeah, we'll have to... <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Bear, we're gonna have to come back to that one, because, uh... I have one. Alright, let's see what Hunter wants. I know that he loves to give me his... horrible... terrible... excruciating... mini-games. Oh god. Oh god, I don't know if that's supposed to, like, jump like that. Hey, Spyro, you know, if you press the A button to jump, then press the A button again in midair. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I glide. Cool. Let's fly in the air, then. Oh, yeah. I forgot that you can... I mean, that's an interesting, like, concept there of... Being able to switch dragon powers. Wait. Yeah, I know. And then if I if I I'm aware, Hunter. I have played a Spyro game before. Nice work, Spyro. And check this out. I found a dragonfly. Here, why so, don't you take it? So we're gonna continue this trend. Of, hey, uh, it's Bubbles. Oh, he. <laughs> Just, all right, there might be some issues on the, the emulator. Mm. Hey, Spyro, you found a challenge portal. Each one of these is a dragonfly magically sealed inside. If you complete the challenge, it will release a dragonfly. That, that sounds easy enough, but what's the challenge? What do I have to do? <laughs> this one is a flame breath challenge. Once activated, eight targets will appear in the area. Bind and flame all of them before the time runs out. Oh, whoops. I keep skipping when, it, when uh, Spyro is talking. I don't see any switches. You purple putts. Oh. All you have to do is walk through the gate to start the challenge. Okay, that dragonfly is as good as free. Okay, that's... And then another one. Man, I'm so used to... An actual Spyro port playing this is like, oh god. This was really going to be the only way that I was going to be able to play this, so. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to beat this game. Even if it kills me. I definitely... Get... Uh, did I not flame that? Uh, okay. <laughs> let's, let's try that again. I thought I got them all, but I guess not. Okay, okay. Okay, that's one. Two. Three. Four. And five. And oh god. Where is where's the last one? Oh, there it is. Damn it. Okay, let's go back and get it. Damn it. Well, tradition never fails, you know? The, the mini games and stuff still suck. If anything, they're going to be really bad. I don't know if anyone out there is 
play through this game, but oh boy, you're in for a, a treat. It is the only thing that for some reason I remember is this UFO mini game thing. And I remember that just being god awful. And that was like the moment where I went, you know what? I don't. I don't want to do this to myself. There we go. That was great, Spyro. You completed the challenge and released a dragonfly. It's G! It's G! <laughs> what kind of name is it? G! Jeet. There is not a single dragon egg that was named Justin. But we got... A dragonfly named Jeet. And I know that was different developers too, so that's part of it. But man, Jeet? Jeet. Anyone out there have a name, uh, Jeet? Is your name Jeet? Any Jeets out there that want to comment? By all means, go for it. Hey, Spyro, check out this big lock. It's surrounded by magical energy. I bet you could unlock it if you zap it with your ele uh, electric breath. Don't forget to switch your breath ability by tapping the L button. You never know when you may need it. Uh, okay, well, I don't have that ability, so we're just going to come back later. I don't think there was... I think there was like a couple more spots that I could go to, and I almost missed that. Oh, and you don't... Do you not get sparks to help you in this one? No, that's... And that's... Oh, no. Oh, no. This has got to be really bad. We... I... Um... Unless it's like, no, or like a, cause Z does the Atlas. Oh, there's 90 dragonflies. That's not too bad. I'm sure I will regret saying that after uh, I try to get them all, but you know, we should be able to get that, hopefully. Oh. Hey, Spyro, check out this block. It's surrounded by magical energy, but you could blast it with your ice breath. You don't have that, though. So you get to turn around and go to the place that you're pretty sure you can go to. Which was, you guessed it, this one. This one right here. All right, let's go. And away we go to our first world. I kind of remember this one, I think. Maybe. Maybe. I wonder what the ending of this game is, because, yeah, I, I never played it. <laughs> or I never beat it, sorry. I just remember the loading times being extremely long and the game playing like shit. And just being like, wait a minute, this isn't Spyro. Oh no, Spyro. Oh, God. It looks like the rip tops have frozen all the dragon masters. Oh my god. You're going to have to use your flame breath to melt the ice and find out what happened here. I know. Thanks. Thanks for uh stating the obvious to me. I I appreciate that. I won't be too negative. Like, right now, honestly, the game's been fine. It hasn't been, like, horrendous. We'll see how I stand a few hours into it, but... Oh, okay, we're just... Hey, it's Steffi! It's Steffi! I love Steffi! Any Steffies out there, please like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, I thought maybe I could 
go under there, but I was wrong. But yeah, the emulation's holding up pretty well. So. And uh, it plays better than it did back then, that's for sure. But yeah, I... The plot device, I... <laughs> I'm back and I'm mad as ever. Like, it's like that. Is that really how we're starting this game? Uh oh. Uh. <laughs> is there another one that just showed up and I missed him? God. So bad. But yeah, I'm gonna chalk up some of the glitches being to the emulator since you know it's not the GameCube, but this was gonna be the easiest way for me to play this and stream it, so I just I did not want to try to finagle anything. Also, I don't have my GameCube anymore. I would have been surprised if it even worked anyway, so. Sorry, I might have had a bug on my leg. Good old uh, emulators. The only thing that's keeping game preservation alive. Because I don't want to have to... F like, if you're not going to sell the game, then don't make it a huge pain in the ass. the sense to free me from that icy cage. Who would have thought the Ritbox would dare invade the sacred Dragonfly Dojo? Spyro. Do what you can to return the dojo to its peaceful state by freeing all of the Dragon Masters. Remember, Spyro, the way of the dragon is to be a dragon. I mean, what else would he be? Thank you for opening the door. So we collect dragons and dragonflies, or it's just dragonflies and it's just dragonflies. Is this, this is all the levels? Oh, oh God. This might be way shorter than I was expecting. <laughs> That can't be the whole game, just that one list there. Like, it still controls like Spyro, it's not... not too bad. What? <laughs> yeah, but like I said, I'll... I'll wait and see how I feel about it... after, but... So far, it's been fine. The other ones get really bizarre, though. Who the fuck is this guy? It's one of Ripto's bullies. He looks pretty dumb, but he's also big and fat. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I don't think you can charge him. Try flaming him. Did you know that most creatures have an aversion to anything above 7,800 degrees Fahrenheit? Wow, thank thanks, Sparks. Thanks for... Thanks for that. I don't know why you needed to tell me to use my my flame breath when uh, I'm already using it. I've been using it. Charging and flaming. Like, why are you telling me that now? I've already started. Yep, and then when you zap me... Hey, Spyro, each time a fairy zaps you like this, that means your progress is saved. If you get into trouble... You'll be returned to the last place you got zapped. Great. <laughs> Who's this little guy? Spyro, my kite got stuck up in the tree. Oh, that sucks. I can't reach it because there's nothing to stand on. Just me. <laughs> I was hoping that maybe I could just. I was hoping I could stand on him and just jump up to the tree. Okay. We'll get your stupid kite from the tree. 
in a second. You know, let me uh, let me do what I came here for first, which is oh, oh, the dragonflies. There he is. Hey, it's Shellac. Shellac? Hey, it's me, Shellac. Uh, if you end up finding the stream afterwards, and if you enjoy watching it, you should subscribe. Because then you will see when I'm streaming, and everything will be a okay. And you can comment. All nice things. Nothing mean, please. I don't... I don't want that. <laughs> okay, I gotta wait for... Yeah, he's gotta open the door for me. How many... How many gems are here? Oh, I thought it was 7,000 gems here. It's 700. Okay, that's... That's, that's doable. Yeah, for this level, we made it to where it's 7,000 gems. Good luck. I think I would actually die doing that. That's that's just a big no thank you there. Let's fight some ninjas, too. Yeah. Can't fuck with Spyro. Okay. I remember too when the uh, when Enter the Dragonfly came out. I think I got it for Christmas, but I remember it came with the soundtrack, and it was Stuart Copeland who, damn, does all the. Bro, he's done at least the original trilogy. And. I was just like, oh my god, it's so cool. I can jam out to the soundtrack. And then I brought it with me into the car, and I lost it. So, gone forever. Ooh, lightning power. Cool. Okay, maybe I can... Oh god, come on, camera. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I don't know why I thought that would work. We definitely gotta get up way higher than that. Yeah, it's definitely not as fluid as Reignited, but I mean, I expected it to be worse because it's such a new game. Spyro-san, I'm sorry the dojo is in such a state for your visit. It's usually a haven of tranquility. Man, this voice acting, let me it's tell you. It's that dragonflies grow up and train to be dragon companions. Protecting young dragonflies is a dragon sensei's highest calling, you know. And Spyro, your efforts will result in much reward. I feel really bad for whoever had to read all of that. All of these lines. They're just terrible. Oh, God. I mean, the references are kind of cool, like, I guess. Yep. Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee, I get it. Reference. What is in here? Oh, there he goes. Yay. Oh, God. <laughs> I thought it froze. I was really worried. Bonsai speed. Oh no! They offer two challenges here: a peaceful obstacle course and a race. Uh, I guess. Okay, easiest way to win the time attack is with the rings. Light the lanterns, bust down the rickshaws, and then chase down the dumb riptox. What is it, Rickshaw? Bonsai. I already forgot what he told me. Maybe this won't be 
too bad. Oh, the lanterns. This was something... It, it just feels like I'm playing a fake game. Like I'm playing like a uh, like a Spyro fan game. Ripto returns for some some reason. Is that what a rickshaw is? The guy in the little wagon thing. I'm sorry if I like I just I genuinely just do not know. Yeah, that's what I figured as a, a rickshaw. Oh god. I feel like a lot of this is just wasting my time. Come on. Oh my god. These are so stupid. I missed when you... Oh god. <laughs> the, uh, the little dude in the bottom is freaking out. Okay, okay, let's go. Oh, there's one. Oh, maybe I can get it. Oh, look at that. Check it out. Did it in one try. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think it's supposed to do that. <laughs> He's just dancing. Do you want to try again? No. Do I actually get something from that? You won a dragonfly for defeating the time trial. There's no stopping us now. You're not going to say that one, Rashomon? It's not how I remembered it, at least. Yeah, let's, let's race the stupid dragons. Use the red dots to guide you. Yep, I'm aware of how this works. Racing. Oh, boy. Look at that. Water. Looks like you're flying on jeans. That's not the developer's fault. It's an old game. Also, I up it so much that you're going to notice a lot of imperfections in it. Flying through the sky. Such riveting shit, but... If you decide to come around, hey, welcome. Welcome to the stream. It's a pretty chill stream. I don't try to be like, Whoa, guys! Oh my god, I can't believe it! I just... I try to treat it like, uh, you know, hey, you're just hanging out at a friend's house, watching them play a game. Kind of like what I did when I played Enter the Dragonfly 20 years ago? Holy fuck. Oh no. That's gonna give me a, a crisis. Uh, shouldn't I be in second place? I missed a ring. Well, they still suck, so... I mean, going back and doing these, it's like, yeah, I kind of expected it to be pretty dog shit, to be honest. Okay, so I guess flaming them does... Nothing? Nothing. Waste of time. So I'm not gonna bother, I guess, doing that. I thought it would knock them out or something, but... 
It doesn't. It doesn't do a goddamn thing. But you can take some pretty sick ass shortcuts like that one. I don't know if that worked, but I'm gonna say it did. Oh, there is a rocket, but I can't get it. Oh, come on. So they had previously stated in the last stream I did. I hate these levels. They are god awful. They're so boring. And oh god. Like why? Why make me do this? Who did I What? Yeah, like I'm I'm passing people and they're just like, nah, you're still in third. It's like I just passed a guy. I guess first and second are up there then and ah, ay, ay, ay. Uh, Game? Game, are you gonna Are you gonna not let me beat this? Okay, now I'm in second. And that's first. That's bullshit. What? What? How did I end up in second? I don't understand that. I have to try it again. I'm so confused. How could I have ended up... How could I have ended up... Sixth or second when I was passing it like you can just you can just straight up just fly right right by them. Yeah, for some reason. Yeah, cause going around you might as well just lose, but yeah, if you like I passed a guy and it didn't count. I got a... <sighs> like, you can take... Yeah, see, because now I'm in third. I guess some of them count, but others don't. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, because... Alright, taking the shortcut. I just passed a guy. Is he not in... Is he not in... Sec is he not in third place? Like, what? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah. I don't understand now, because... I straight up passed a guy, and I am, I am in third? How? Now I'm in second. And I'm gonna probably lose, yeah, I'm gonna lose again. I, okay. <laughs> what? My time was even better then. Oh my god. Okay. All right. Fine. No shortcuts. I will go the path that they tell me to go. Because it seems like whenever I do the shortcuts, that is when it goes bad for me. So yeah. Okay. I'll follow your your red dotted line here. Why not? Why not? Ah, uh, don't worry. I'll get to you eventually. I'm fourth now. Okay, if I can keep this up, maybe, just maybe. 
I can get. I'm not going to catch up to them now. Where's the other racers? Where are they? Where are they? They have to be somewhere. Oh, there's one. Oh, my God. Come on. <sighs> I'm glad they could carry over the part I hated the most. I can at least get this one right. That's not going to fuck it up, right? It fucked it up. <laughs> Don't go through the fucking things. You will not get... Are you kidding me? Because, yeah, then I'll burn this guy. Oh, it, it, it didn't. Okay, I passed a guy. And somehow I'm in third place. How am I in third place? And I have passed every single person. And I got like a worse time out of it too. What the fuck is this? Oh my god. Oh, I oops. All right, that was on me. I I did it though. And it's telling me that no. No, I didn't. But I straight up Yeah. Oh, oh, and now I'm in 5th. Okay. Do you need to flame them? Can you not just pass them? Okay, because now I'm in fourth. Like, okay. Cool. I'm in fourth. That makes sense. Are they passing me? Because I'm not seeing them pass me. Okay, okay. I'm in third. Oh, now I'm in fourth. Now I'm in third. Okay. I'm in third place now. I'm like watching this game like a hawk now. Like, okay. Don't fuck me this time, game. This is some bullshit. I passed him. Does that not count? Did they put the fucking guy up a million miles ahead of me now? I think I'm about to lose. That's that's another guy I passed. I should be in first. Why am I not in first? What is happening? Oh my god. Okay, I flamed that one, and it's over. What is happening? <laughs> I should have won three times now. Is this shit just fucking busted? I'm not going crazy, right? I should have won that. So many times, like the, the fucking enemy just magically appears in front of me. Yep, see, like, it, oh, and now I'm in fifth. Oh my god. 
It might be a problem with the emulation, too. But if I don't emulate it, oh my god, it gets wood. Like, I, I should have beaten this. Okay. I didn't flame him that time, and I'm in fourth. Should I go and get... I'm gonna get the rocket, too. The rocket didn't pick up. That's okay. Oh, it did, but it didn't tell me that I got it. It just... You ran into it, but it doesn't... Oh, I'm in third. Oh, now I'm in fourth. Now I'm in third. Ah, <laughs> uh, what the fuck? What is wrong with this game? I'm fucking believable. Hello? Oh, okay, no, he that you're right, I didn't get it because he teleported five thousand feet ahead of me. And I'm actually in third, even though I'm I'm not. And okay, that's not a homing one. Still in third, huh? Still in third. Right, right, okay. That makes sense. I mean, it doesn't, but sure, okay. Can you just not win this? Second place. And he already won. How? What? Okay, so let's see. Supercharging without pressing the square button. I found this by charging. For some reason I was playing on. Oh, that's. If you pass an inch when you're supposed to be second, you'll always stay in third. What? Okay, so, race ninjas then get into second place. The number on the side of the screen tells you that you went, it's, you want to pass the ninja in first. It still says I'm in third, even when I follow all the red dots. What might have happened was you lapped the ninjas in last and second to last place, making you think you were in first when you were really third. That's how it worked in... Have to hit almost all the speed stars to win the race. If you hit, if you race without hitting the stars, you will lose. Oof. Okay. So don't miss a single one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, that's great. That's awesome. Okay, I'm in fifth, fourth, I missed. Awesome, I turned too soon. I'm gonna beat this. I will not let this defeat me. I mean, I know I did it. I let it defeat me in the first Spiral Dragon, but that was a different me. God damn it, I missed it. Can you at least... Okay, well... 
Maybe if just missing that one. I forgot that it even existed. Okay. Okay. I'm not seeing another speed star until that one. So let's try to Let's try to get it. Okay. Oh, shit. I missed it again. God damn it. I gotta remember that that's there. But yeah, they're saying if you don't hit all the speed stars, you might as well just give up because it's not gonna register that. Okay, great. Yep, passed up a ninja again. Okay, so even on the not emulated version, that this is just an issue that this game has. Well, that's awesome. And really fucking bizarre. And I missed that stupid thing again. Like, this is impossible. And they're like, oh, maybe you actually didn't get it. And it's like, no, nah, dude, I... Okay. Okay. You, you really do have to hit every single star. This is the only way. Because the game is broken and doesn't understand what place you're in. So you'll pass up somebody, and the game will think, no, you're not in first, you're actually in third. You didn't actually pass up that person. It's like, no, no, I did. I did. I know for a fact that I did. Oh my god. So there's only like three stars that I see here that you can pass through. What a crock of shit. And that other... That other star, man, it... It sneaks up on you. Yeah, you have to, like, immediately dip and then go through the ring. See? Because then you see two other people ahead of you and you're like, oh, yeah, no. I'm gonna pass those guys up. Easy peasy. Well, here's the thing doesn't work. There's two people ahead of me. That doesn't make any sense. You're gonna tell me that... Oh my god. Just... Fucking hell, dude. Okay. And then you hit this one. Okay, and now I'm in first. Which I should have been a long-ass time ago. Honestly, I was waiting for it to glitch and tell me I was in sixth place. That is straight up fucking busted. But I... Perfect timing. No. I will never do that one again. That is fucking hilarious that it's broken. But it also is infuriating because I'm trying to beat it. Those ninjas were so embarrassed after being whipped by a dragon that they dropped this dragonfly trying to run away. That'll teach them. Oh, it's Yojimbo! Hey, it's Yojimbo. How come we didn't say Roshamon? That's another uh, classic Japanese film. It's weird that they're picking Japanese films, but they're picking Chinese martial artists for the is it Chinese or is it Japanese for the king guys come on uh, does this have okay let me see if this has like a I wonder if there's a hidden hunter level in this one too because it probably is 
Hunter. Hunter. Where are you? Hunter. Hunter. You sack of shit, where are you? I know you're here. There's not... There's gotta be a reason they let me just fly around and do whatever I want in this. You son of a bitch, where are you? I know you're here. Hunter? Hunter, where are you? I'm stuck in the tree. Hmm. I guess I'm gonna have to check and see if there's any hunter challenges as well. I feel like I'm f passing it up. Let's look. <sighs> Challenges. And enter the dragonfly. Okay, actually, yeah, let's just pull up a guide. I hate that I'm even pulling up a guide. Dojo. Oh. Get out of here. All these challenges covered in the section as a guide. And trust me, you'll need some guides bold in their toughies. Please see the challenge section. Okay. I'm not seeing that section. Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna <laughs> roll with the punches then. Give up? Yes. Please. No, I'm not gonna try again because I didn't see that there was a hunter level, so it should be okay. I would not like to do any of them anymore. I am good. I am done. Let me enjoy the good parts. Yeah. Oh, God. What a fucking nightmare. So there's one part that you're not going to be able to get the dragonfly at because you need the ice power. And I have lightning, but I can't use it yet because i got to take it back to the place. I'm just flying forever. Man. Man, oh man. What a travesty. <laughs> Even the guide was like... Yo, these races fucking suck. <laughs> Good luck. Gonna have a terrible time on them. Like, oh, awesome. Oh, that. Uh. Oh. Don't okay. That's kind of busted, but alright. Okay, so there's gotta be a way to get up to that kite but it looks like it's from that section up there no that doesn't make any sense there's nothing I can't tell if it's no it's not a thing okay well I try to fly from there and that you gotta fly really high we'll just have to we'll have to come back to it 
I heard something, but I guess he just glitched out and disappeared. Uh, I think I'm going to have my work cut out for me. Like, I know what happens at the end of the first Spyro game, so... Because I 100 percent it before, I did it on an emulator, but... Still, you know, like, honestly, who cares if you stay of state? It's not that big of a deal. Like, if a part's really fucking annoying, just save state. It doesn't matter. No one's gonna judge you. You beat it. It's all that matters. Who cares? Play the game how you want to. It's your time. You are a dragon wise oh, Jet Li. beyond your years. May the dragon spirits guide you on your way. So far, this game feels like someone explained to somebody what Spyro was, and then they kind of understood it. It was like if my dad was like, uh, yeah, I watched him play the game for like five minutes before I fell asleep. It had some dragons in it, and uh, there was a guy there, and also, oh, I thought he was, <laughs> thought he was like dripped out. Spyro. In trouble again, I see. What a surprise. Dragons in danger or something like that? Well, you'll have to pay me 200 gems to cross this mighty line. If he is in Spyro 4, if that ever happens, although I may be practicing compassion, I want him. Still has my soul. I want to be able to knock this man into the stratosphere. Like he better not Thanks, be able to do this. These gems are music to my ears and will do wonders as inspiration for my poetry. But look, Spyro, even I know some magic when properly motivated. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, money bags. You're a piece of shit. You always have been, and you always will be. Oh, there's multiple kites in the thing. Yay. Just gotta keep collecting gems. And I guess which master oh god. Good work. Toshiro? Son. That's Ritox don't seem to be much of a challenge for you. Perhaps you should contemplate a career as a Is he the guy from Seven sensei? Samurai? It could the be main your guy? density. I mean, your destiny. Toshi. Now, I will open that gate. That, it appears, is my that destiny. That is not... I mean, <laughs> it's not who you're looking Spyro. for. Toshiro. Yeah, 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 no, he's... I mean, he's in a, a lot of things. It's so weird to see him without a mustache. Yeah, he's in, uh... Yojimbo, The Hidden Fortress, Seven Samurai, Throne of Blood. Basically, if it was a Kurosawa movie, he was in it. Because Kurosawa really liked him. He's also in High and Low. It's not a samurai movie. It's more of a uh, crime thriller. Not, not really. A cr well, I, guess, I mean, there is crime. It's more of a thriller type thing. But it's so well shot. I mean, not a surprise because it's Kurosawa. But, God. That's a good one. That's the one I feel like people overlook for his movies. It's always like Seven Samurai or Rashomon, Roshimon, however you say it. And then uh, Hidden Fortress because it's the main, one of the main inspirations for Star Wars. And I mean, when you watch it, it's, that is Star Wars. <laughs> Night and day Star Wars. Not a bad thing. I mean, everything gets inspiration from something. I mean, there's a lot of things that inspired it. <gasps> oh my god, it dawned on me. Oh. Oops. But yeah. Uh, yeah, if you never watch a Kurosawa movie, I highly recommend it. I mean, <laughs> he's only one of the most prolific uh, directors of all time. Every movie he's made is celebrated, so... Definitely check them out. Even if you're not into black and white movies, check them out anyway. 
Seven Samurai is so goddamn good. Once again, not really a controversial take. Tree all day. There's something shiny up there. And I just know the kite's lost last night. Can you save my kite, Mr. Spyro? That tree is so hard to climb. Maybe there's another way to reach the kite. Oh, it sure is hot out here. <laughs> yeah, sure. Let me try to get it. Is this the way to get it? Uh, it is not. Okay. Well, I should take that anyway, though, because it's the only way I can get back. I feel really bad. I, like, all I've been thinking is how bad I feel for the developers of this game. It's so busted. It's, and two, it's like, you almost got it. Kinda. And then, no. I feel like they try to play it too safe, but I feel like they had to because if not, uh, this game would not have finished. They're like, oh, we have to have this stuff, and like, I guess, I guess. But then, then it gets from looking at the other games. Oh, oh God! Like, I feel like we're gonna see some some weird some weird shit with uh, the series. We do see Cinder later, but as a dragon, not a dragonfly. That's going to be a Legend of Spyro. I downloaded that and tried it out just to make sure that it worked. It is essentially God of War Spyro, which sounds awesome, but it's is rough. Gary Oldman's in it for some reason, and... Elijah Wood, some other celebrities too, but yeah, that's gonna be a weird, really weird one. I mean, like, I get it, cause like, well, the kids that were playing that, now they're playing God of War, you know, like, we gotta go with the times, but, uh, and I played a little bit of Hero's Tale, and it felt like I was playing like a Nickelodeon game. <laughs> Oh, I felt like that was an even bigger departure, but I only played a few minutes of Welcome it, so who knows. Training arena, Private Dragon. Now okay. I've got a prize for you if you can destroy all the dummy tanks. But oh. Thanks, you'll have to... But you'll have to figure out how to get past the gates. Oh, crap. How do I control the tank? Shoot with the X button. You can raise the turret with the B button. And lower it with the A. Try holding down the Y button for targeting mode. Turn the turret with the left and the right buttons. Will you clear out the tank training arena? Sure. Mini games. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, I should be able to do this, no problem. Oops, I hit the wrong button. I forgot what button it was that I just used. Look at all these bunnies. Uh -oh. oh my god. Good luck avoiding those. Holy fuck a Rooney. Uh, uh, there we go. And. Oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. Okay, do the bunnies heal you? I guess they heal you. Maybe. Just <laughs> running over. Oh god. Yeah, it does heal you. Okay, we should be able to do this then. Oh my god, where did you guys come from? Holy shit. What the f- What the fuck? Okay, that's another one down. It's- Uh-oh. Okay. 
As long as I shoot them before they shoot me, I should be good. I could have sworn that one of them was shooting me over here. But maybe not. I'm going to shoot this just to, just to make sure that no one's sneaking around. Oh, God. Oh, come on. Come on. You can't control the camera. You have to... <laughs> if you turn, then it moves the camera a little bit. Oh, okay. Uh, Alright. Uh, there's one. And then... Then the other. Okay. No, 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 no. I, oh, God. I gotta, I gotta run over the bunnies. Oh, my God. I think it, this, <laughs> this level is relentless. Oh, it's not hard. It's just like, game, give me a second. <laughs> Oh my god, come on. Ugh. Poor bunnies. I remember, I think I got this game for Christmas alongside Dr. Muto? That game was horrible. Terrible game. I don't know, maybe it's okay now. Like, maybe I can play it and try it, but... I feel s I feel so bad for my dad for buying so many random ass games that I ended up did not liking. But I played the demo disc and I'm like, oh, the demo is pretty cool. And then I tried the game and it was too fucking hard. At least for kid brain me it was. I remember also trying to play like Haven Call of the King. Could not figure out what the hell was going on with that one. But I think that, once again, I think I should, could probably be able to f f finagle that one. Well oh, done, thank Robert. God it's done. You're a clever dragon, ain't you? Smart enough to get the gates open and skillful enough to survive the tanks. As sure reward, am. I'll let you have the dojo mascot. Wow, thanks. It's <laughs> Cub. Hey, it's Cub. It sure is. If you'd like, I can set up some more dummies for you. Would you like to do some target practice? Do you get another dragonfly? I don't think you don't get another dragonfly. Never mind. Let me look at the atlas here. Okay, 7 out of 10. Yeah, no, let's... Let's get out of this part. <laughs> Clearly, it he gave, gave up. What kind of soldier are you? No. Well, that's too bad. Yeah, I'm not doing that. I'm not going to do it more than I need to. <sighs> I hope you're out there enjoying the stream. I didn't upload a video because I feel like... I don't know. I feel like I have a lot of stuff already done, made, and all that stuff, and I wanted people to get a chance to actually check out any of the stuff that I've posted, like, video-wise. But I think I'm going to stick to maybe just streaming. I feel like that'll just be better for me, in general. Because, uh-oh, uh-oh, he's... Okay, that was weird. It was just... Sliding around. Ah, uh, he's. <laughs> I think this is. I think this is the emulator fucking up. <laughs> oh my god. That's. At least, at least some of the glitches are really funny. Just, just like t posing. 
dragon posing. Poor guy. This fire deserves better than this. Like, this seems like a game that would have just been released on itch. It's like, this is what I think Spyro 4 should be. Like, oh wow, you did it in Unity, great. Hey, it's cloudy. No, oh, it's a little cloudy out. <laughs> okay, let's switch back to the firepower and run straight into the wall. I cannot get these goddamn kites. They're way too high up. <laughs> Maybe there's a trick to get them. Oh, I hear you guys up here. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to think of who else the the ninja master people could be. Who's this guy's name? You have done Chow. Well, oh, Chow Yun Fat. Freeing the dragon senses hard boiled courage. I think this baby dragonfly will be safe with you. Other John Woo movies. There's also that stranglehold game. <laughs> hey, it's Roxy. It sure is. Remember, Spyro. Find and return the remaining baby dragonflies. They are the fortune of the Dragon Realms. <laughs> I guess. That's first I'm hearing of it, but sure, I guess. to talk to him first and then it oh okay that is <laughs> that's really bad oh no thanks so much mr spyro i've been looking for this kite it's all dougie summer. A dragon without a dragonfly is like peanut butter without jelly. Or you know, that's not quite right. <laughs> no, you were right. God. I got a feeling this will be pretty inter if anything, it's gonna be entertaining to myself, so. God, enter the dragonfly. Forgot all all about this game. And then it all just I remembered this level kind of. And and then the UFO level. Anything else? It's gonna be new to me. Or it's like a UFO mini game. I remember you had to pick up uh stuff. That was it. I think you were picking up cows or sheep. And put him in a barn. Oh, I did it. Okay, well, let's, uh... How do I get the... Oh, I missed a gem over there, too. Oh, that was the last gem I needed, too. Even better. Hmm. Games were cheaper, sort of, back then, so. That sounded like a, the sound effect from Figure It Out. It was a game show on Nickelodeon. I think the host of that game show went on to be a sports commentator for ESPN, I think. 
I just remember being like, where did she go? I liked that host. Where did she go? And then, yeah, she... Probably, then, you know, realized, like, oh, yeah, I don't want to be... I don't want to be on a kid's game show for the rest of my life. I have better things to do. Yeah, I, I know. I'm trying. I just don't know where to go. Like, I need to fly up there, but from from where? From up here? No, that's not going to be high enough. And then there's like, yeah, there's this spot way up here, but if you try to fly from there, you don't, you don't make it. Oh god, what is, what is Spark saying? Yeah, no. no. Oh god, that did not mean to do that. Okay, I don't know how to... I don't know how to get up there. It's probably really stupid simple, too. And I'm not checking how to find it on the internet. Enter Dragonfly Kites. Okay, well perfect. Someone someone did it for me. Oh my god. This video is from twelve years ago. Oh, you need to have you need to have ice powers. Oh. Oh, well. Okay. Cool. Well, uh, there's nothing else that I can do, right? All right, let's just, cause I don't trust this game to have exit level working correctly. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna run to the exit. Actually, you know what? I feel like exit level should work just fine. That was a long way back. I'm not doing that. There's all the treasures found. Wow. Oh, fuck. Shit. Wow. How's everyone doing? My usual Spyro guy's not here. It makes me sad. Must be at work at something. It's fine. If anything, he'll see that this is here. Epic zombie killer. I'm waiting for you. Okay. Open sesame. Oh god, it's moving. <laughs> stop moving. Please stop moving. Yep. Put it in. Now I have electricity. Oh my god. This fucking front. Does it turn into corn dogs? I mean. Who wouldn't turn into a corn dog, right? Oh, I thought it was a level opened up over there. I was like, wait a minute. That doesn't make any sense. This is, uh, broken, so we're just gonna... I think it's electric breath for this one? I think? Yeah, it was. Yay! A new part of the level. Oh, boy. That's just my non-existent inventory.
Press and hold Y button to look around. Sometimes you get a better view this way. That's great. What do I need a better view of? The nothing? Like, he has to explain it to me so many times in a row, like, dude. Oh. Hey, it's Kanichi. Kanichi. I hope I do beat this. It'll feel good to beat the Spyro game that I couldn't beat. And then the other ones, those are just straight up mysteries to me on if those are going to be any good. Climbing is about. I, I know how to climb. I know. I know. I understand. This was the first Spyro game to not be on a. Only Sony platform. Oh my god. You found a challenge board to one of these as a dragonfly magically. You, you do not need to tell me this again. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Well, what is he? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh. All right. That was weird. Just another glitch in the game, I guess. Youch. He didn't say that before. At least I don't think he did, but that's gonna get real annoying, I'm sure. Well then, that was some some bullshit. I got stuck on the damn. Uh, what the hell is that? Can I swim yet? Okay, cool. I'm glad that wasn't just like a locked ability or something. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of really good indie platformers that are out and doing essentially what Spyro was doing and like other like Banjo Kazooie and things like that so I I don't really know necessarily if an old franchise needs to come back I think that there's a lot of interesting stuff that people are doing like Signalis I mean that's a horror game but like that that game people were calling it the best horror game and it was small team might have just been one person I don't I don't know but and like hat in time now that's a platformer and hat in time did fantastic the developers of it are awesome too and I mean demon turf was another one ready for a dip spot Sparks, I already went in the water. We were just there, buddy. You know, thank you for, I guess, trying to be helpful. But, yeah, no, I already did that. It's Amy. Hey, it's Amy. Great. What a horrible way to spell it. <laughs> I hope there's a dragonfly named Justin. Hey, it's Justin. And then I can be like, oh, it's me. I'm... I'm the guy. It's not gonna happen, though. Who likes Justins, anyway? All the worst celebrity Justins are out there, you know? And just giving me a bad rep. Okay. Alright, money bags, how many fucking gems you want this time? 
Uh, you're not money bags. Oh, you're you're... Glad to see you. You might be able to get this boat to wake if you had enough dragonflies. To wake. Savages on that island. Savages, I tell you. <laughs> I need fifteen dragonflies. I have fourteen. Or no, wait. Yeah, fourteen. Okay. Yeah. All right. God, I really don't remember anything. But yeah, so like Demon Turf, Hat in Time, uh, there was like a whole bundle and had those two games in it, but as a 2D platformer, but Celeste and like Shovel Knight have been better than most games that have been coming out. Where I'm a, he's doing a little dance. Look at him go. Oh, look at his hat. Oh God, I'm just gonna leave him. Leave him be. Hey, Spyro, please, for the love of God, help me. I'm... Oh, God. All right, so this time I'm not going to jump up to where the farmer guy... I have the wrong power selected. Okay. I'm going to not go where that guy is because he will glitch me into the ladder. And I really don't want to do that. These aren't. Oh my god. I feel like I'm gonna get real sick of hearing him say youch, though. Youch. Okay. Now, where is. Where's the last one? I hope it's not in the water. That wouldn't make any sense. No idea where that last one is. Okay, maybe it's by the, the farmer guy. It looks like you can break it open. Ouch! Ouch! He is gonna say that every time I run into walls. Ouch! Yep. Ouch! Ah, uh, that was that was <laughs> that was not something that needed to be added. That's for sure. Oh, it was by him. Oh, hey, Spyro, please help me. I'm, I'm dying. Everybody needs help from Spyro, but they never ask if Spyro needs help. Okay. I'm gonna do it. I believe. So far, I'm not totally hating the game, though. I was really expecting to just disown the game, but it's honestly just been fine. Except for a few instances that that was pretty fucking bad, like the race. That was great, Spyro. I know. It's Alex. Hey, it's Alex. Yay. There was an Alex in the last one. I can go where Porky Pig wants me to go, Porklin, whatever his name was, but I'm not gonna go to that. What did this guy? Oh my God, his face is horrifying. Oh, God. Okay, yeah, let's talk to him. Wow, that's a lot of dragonflies, Spyro. You should have no problem getting this here UFO to work now. Hop aboard, but beware. The space cows, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. What is this guy? He looks like a cabbage patch. He looks horrifying. Oh, they don't have teeth, and it's just, ugh. You look in their mouth, I'm like, oh, God, there's nothing in there. Come on. Let's load her up. Let's 
fuck, what a travesty, man. These load times are killer. Oh, God, where? Oh, where'd they go? This is the level. Spyro, space Farmer Dale. From nowhere and have overrun the farm looking for dragonflies. Since they haven't been able to find any, they've been abducting cattle. It just and sounds like Aaron from Game, Game Grumps. <laughs> and I'm afraid I'm next. Don't worry, I'll help you. He does talk to them though. You will. Instead of Jolly just thing. looking at him the whole you time. Need to go around back and unlock the big red barn and rescue them cows. He must be from Florida. Okay. Well, let's uh Space Diet. See, that should be cool. And it just isn't. You know, this game might have been. Actually, I think it would have been absolutely destroyed if it wasn't Spyro. People would have been just been like, "This is the worst game of the." Actually, you know what? Maybe it would have done better if it was not Spire. Oh no, it crashed. Oh no, it didn't. Oh, thank God. Oh, it's having a hard time on this level. It's having a really tough time on this level. <laughs> it's been working fine up until this point. Uh Tatsuro! I know! Oh my god! It doesn't even make the sound. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, ouch. They could have just not put that in. If I have. Yeah, ouch. If I have to hear him say yowch. Yeah, one more goddamn time. But come on. Come on. I wonder what this game would have looked like if they could have actually worked on it more. They yeah, got it's crazy, you know, it's a it's a field that will make you grind your fucking brains to the bone, you know, like just brain bones. Hmm. You you have to like grind your bones down, and just Ouch. it will just destroy you. But they do not want to preserve a goddamn thing. They do not care. It's like you want to overwork all these people to hit deadlines, and then you don't even give a shit about what the product is. You just want something out because you only care about the mighty dollar. Fuck. Like, that was a dream for so many people of, I want to work in the game industry, and then people saw, especially with, like, Twitter and stuff, or, I'm sorry, X, fucking stupid-ass name, they were like, oh, maybe I don't want to actually do this, because dealing with gamers sucks. It's awful. Everyone, like, the Starfield shit was like, they want it, my pronouns? Like, shut up. We're getting, like, fake offended by stupid shit. Like, it's just... God, there's just so much more to life than dealing with this. Who gives a fuck? God. Fucking die, you son of a bitch. Oh, oh God. This game doesn't run well uh, if you're just doing original hardware, though. It does run at like 20 to 30 frames a second, and it is horrible. It stutters so much, and I think that's part of why it's been okay. It's because I'm, I'm playing it a little more enhanced. Hey, you're Spyro, ain't you? Glad to meet you. Farmer Dane. 
Yo, no blitz. What's up? I was wondering if any of you guys would show up. Playing Enter the Dragonfly now. Uh. Because I beat the Reignited trilogy. And. I figured I'd. Play more Spyro games. I know it's not the best one. Far from it. Uh, I think this is considered the worst Spyro game. But I think it's because it had a follow-up on... Uh, Gear of the Dragon, and that did so goddamn well. Hey, it's Mitnick. Mitnick? That's not a name. There's no way that anything, anyone... Yeah, the, I remember playing the demo as well, and I was like, oh, the demo. Demo's not too bad. I'm ready to, to play the whole game. And then I got it for Christmas, and uh, I don't know why I was okay with getting <laughs> this one, and I didn't ask for two in Year of the Dragon, but here we are. I was not a smart kid. I mean, I, I liked a lot of random-ass games, but I don't know why I want it. The shit. I, I mean, then again, I thought it was going to be the same people. It's, it's not going to be different at all. It was different. It's like wearing the skin of Spyro. But this ain't Spyro. It's like Invasion of the Fucking Body Snatchers of Spyro. Uh-oh, the camera's stuck. Did you ever beat this game, though? You said you only played the demo. Did you ever uh, see it to the end? Maybe play it with some friends? Because I think I was the only one of my friends that liked playing Spyro games. I don't remember too many people being like, Yeah, Spyro! I feel like around this time people were like, I want to play that GTA game! And I just... Well, I ended up playing GTA as well, but... Something about 3D platformers, man. They they satisfied the collecting itch. But yeah, this game is something else. Everybody in it looks horrifying. It kind of reminds me of that uh, that movie Hoodwinked, where all of the people in it just look disgusting. Or food fight. Oh God. That that is just straight up bulbous and disgusting looking. I played it a bit growing up as Blockbuster was around. Yeah. I do miss being able to just rent a game. Just try it out, but now it's like, well, now you can just do PlayStation Plus and I mean you get a way better deal out of it, but if you wanted to try the latest game though, you'd have to go and rent it. And you could do it at one time at like red box but those don't have games anymore and then uh family video was also another one but that doesn't exist anymore i had uh, some really weird uh video stores back in the day too remember one was called like dave's movies and more that's where I found the Dragon Ball GT game. I was like, I don't know what the hell Dragon Ball GT is, but I'm going to get it. It was awful. It's one of the worst games I've ever played in my life. There's a space riptock holding that dragonfly hostage. If you activate all the platforms around the tower by jumping Movie on, gallery going as well. Lower the tower down so you can I don't know what movie gallery is. We had uh, one called Video Video. You could rent like N64s and stuff. That was pretty cool. Attempt to try a My dad rented a, a game called Heart of Darkness. We had no idea what that game was, and that game is very fucking hard. Uh, and really dark, like spooky. A kid just gets fucking fried to death in it at one point. Shit was was wild. I didn't know what it was for so long until uh, I watched Game Grumps play it. Oh god, how do you do this? 
This is terrible. <laughs> Do I need to like shock these? Or do I need a... Okay, I just need to hit the button. What was another one? Yeah, yeah, family video, that was... Or like Hollywood video, that one I didn't really have access to. Uh, I went there once and was like, ah, oh, this place is okay, but... Blockbuster was the main one. If we were going to Blockbuster, it was going to be a good night. And then, uh, then you realize that, uh, like, people would steal shit all the time. That was super annoying. I wanted to play this Street Fighter game, which turned out being, like, the worst one. It was, like, EX Alpha for PS2. Just so shitty. But someone snatched it, and they put siphon filter in it. So I was just stuck with that, and I'm like, you've got to be kidding me. So the person at the counter is like, you can get a different game, and of course I couldn't find anything. And I ended up getting... Oh, fuck. Cool. I ended up getting a game, I think it was... I remember getting a game called Whiplash. That was a platformer. If it was a platformer, I was going to play it. I think I've played every single one. Blockbuster was great for conventional means. Yeah. I mean, man. I guess I'm like, I miss like the novelty of Blockbuster, but I think a lot of it is rose tinted goggles. Where they're like, oh yeah, you remember going to the... They're like, oh, I miss looking through the the videos and seeing what random shit you'd find. And, and it's like, yeah, but don't you also remember when you were trying to get a movie and they didn't have any? And so you had to pick something else and you ended up picking something that was really fucking terrible. And you're like, oh, I guess I'll chance it on it. Because honestly, like, streaming is so much fucking better than Blockbuster. Just the convenience of it. There's no late fees. It's cheaper, too. I mean, it, right now it's cheaper. Until, like, all the, <laughs> all the streaming stuff gets bloated in price. And then we go right back to pirating things again. Because... Man, I hate that not everything is just on, like, one streaming platform. I mean, it sucks for shit like musicians for, like, Spotify for what they get paid, but, man, Spotify is so nice. I don't have to, like, look around and try to find random, uh, <laughs> random streaming things to listen to an album. That's infuriating. But for movies, like, oh, you want to watch all of a series of a movie? Like, oh, try to go watch all the the Nightmare on Elm Street movies. Oh, what do you mean you can't watch every single one of them back to back? Or Friday the 13th, or Halloween. I'm like, nope, you have to subscribe to, like, three different services to get that. So stupid. But they don't care. Because they're like, oh. What are you going to do? Pirate it? And then they're also like, oh, what are you going to do? Buy it? You're not going to buy it. You don't have a Blu-ray player. Even though most people do, but, you know. You know, some people get, like, made fun of for buying physical media, and I'm like, dude, physical media is awesome. Oh my god, this is the worst level in the fucking game. <sighs> the camera gets stuck and Spyro just gets fucking destroyed. Wait, oh my god, this is so long. It's not even hard. That's the part that's killing me. But yeah, uh, I think if, if they did like a... Like another blockbuster type thing, it would have to be just some kind of like novelty store. Like, ooh, you could rent get stuff here. And like... I mean, places like, uh, like Vintage Stock, 
exist or V stock or entertain Mart or whatever it's called in your region. Uh, if you have one, but like those are things. And then like you can rent games from there. But other than that, you don't, I don't know. It sucks. Like, I wish I, there was a place that I could go to where I could try out random old games, but then you realize that you can just emulate all of them. And then, yeah, there's the purists out there that'll be like, yeah, I wanna, I wanna play it on the original systems, the original systems where it's at. But, man, fuck that. Oh my god, fuck this level. It's not hard, I'm just not paying attention. But yeah. It's it's just way better just to emulate things. Like, that's where we're gonna get to. It's like, eventually... Eventually, we'll be able to just stream whatever the fuck we want. Or we can if you go through the... I'm not condoning piracy but if you do pirate the game I mean if they're not trying to sell it to you you had no other means like oh what should I give $300 to some guy the corporation behind that's gonna hate that even more also like for games like Kuon and like Rule of Rose like I'm not spending $800 for one game you're out of your damn mind now, what is streaming? Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, that's emulation on, uh, yeah. I, uh, yeah, I, I like being able to emulate things and being able to, like, I mean, there's, there's some means that some people don't even know about, like, uh, like, going to your library. The library has a shit ton of, well, at least my library does. Oh, that's awesome. I can't turn the camera because the tractor's there. Oh my god, this level is so ass. Yeah, the library has so many games, and you can just order them, too. I ordered uh, Gotham Knights because I was curious about it, but I didn't want to actually buy it. Perfect game for that kind of thing. I ended up beating it, but okay, cool, I'm done with that level. I almost got the platinum on that. That game wasn't that bad. Well, it was fair. fine. Purple for free, great game. Spoke. If I had to pay for now, it, I'd be pissed. For you, Thanks for giving me the dragonfly. <laughs> Rickshaw. Hey, <it's> Rickshaw. <laughs> That's not a name. Uh, um, but yeah. I don't like how much stuff just gets like trickled through too for the PlayStation Plus stuff. They're like, oh, well, you can play old games. Like, great. Here's one game. Oh, wow. One? There's thousands, thousands of PS1 games. One? One. I mean, it was smart of them to add trophy support at least because some people were like, well, why would I want to play old games? Like, well, get the trophies for him. Fuck it, why not? Oh, I thought there was something on my screen. It's just the the PNG of loading please wait taking its time. Yeah. PlayStation Plus, Game Pass, and then <laughs> Nintendo's embarrassing offering of uh Whatever the fuck they're doing, that shit is whack. They never, ever have games that you want to play. Hey, it's on. Yeah. Well, because like, I feel like, too, because they're like, nobody plays the classic games. And then it's like, well, yeah, because the way that you have it is 
garbage. If you had it, if you had it better, sh I'm sure people would actually do it. And also, a lot of people just emulate it because they're like, well, it's gonna be better this way. Like they, the support for emulators on consoles are so bare bones. Like, why would I use? Why would I use PlayStation stuff or or anything if I can just emulate it for free? And I know that's part of why they're like, oh, we don't want people downloading ROMs and stuff. Like, well, then do better. You're doing you're doing nothing. You gotta you gotta do something. Give a shit that people are asking for, and maybe people will actually use the damn service that you're providing. And also, give us a better offering than, like... I think one of them was... Yeah, Tekken 2, they added that. Um, oh yeah, that, do that doesn't have trophy support, you're right. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck they were thinking for that. But yeah, like, uh, there was like, uh, IQ. I think that's what that game was called. It's like a, or no, PQ. That's what it was. It's like a puzzle game. Where, uh, you're like running away from like a cube. That's a really fun game. And that has a platinum trophy that you can get. And I didn't get it, but you can rewind and restart levels pretty easily. So you can get that that trophy, that platinum trophy, pretty easily. They added Pursuit Force as well. That was a game that I was curious about because I remember getting the demo in the mail, and that was so weird to get. It's like for some reason, like I don't, I wasn't signed up to anything. I just got it in the mail. I'm like, what is this? Yeah, Twisted Metal. Yeah, like that. That was a smart one. I mean, especially because of the the TV show and stuff too, so it made sense for them to to add that one. But yeah, like give us. I would really like to play. I know they're obscure. I mean, they're more popular now, and Sony pushed the hell out of it for a while. But let me play Persona One and Two, please. <laughs> they're so goddamn expensive now. Just let me play them. I bought them on the PlayStation 3 store. Let me access it on the PlayStation 5. That's all I'm asking for. Like, I feel like it should have at least, bare minimum, should have launched with all the games you can get on PS3 right now, currently, to buy. Like, that's just insane. Also, why... Why Tekken 2? The best one is 3. That one was amazing. I mean, like, I love Tekken 2. That was one I played a lot growing up, too. But Tekken 3. Ooh. That is, like, peak Tekken. And we didn't hit those heights until Tekken 5, because Tekken 4 was a, a fucking train wreck. And then uh, Tekken 6 was fine. I guess. But Tekken 7? Ooh! Tekken 7. It's cooking. I don't know what spices they put in that game, but... Damn. Zesty. Fucking delicious. They are, uh... <laughs> absolute... Peak fighting game right there. And Tekken 8... I hope... I'm sure it's gonna be amazing, but god, I hope it is. Like, I just really want it to be amazing. If it can have some great net code, oh, it'd be so nice to have a functioning fighting game. Because the net code for Tekken 7 is kind of dookie. It's not too bad on PC, but it just takes forever to get in the game. So long for no reason. Why shit take so long? Uh, oh, 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 okay. The, 
the game was having a hard time figuring out what the hell I was doing. Okay, uh... This is... This is... This is embarrassing. What a... I'm on a really bad level. Oh, got it. Did I get the... The dragonfly? Tetsu. Hey, it's Tetsu. That is not how you say that name. <laughs> it's Tetsu. Not Testu. Testu? Sound like said Testu. What's some other banger classic games that I'd like to see? Uh <laughs> They're remaking Gex, so I don't have to... Oh my god. Like a busted ass level. Okay. Oh, well. Uh, th there is... A, there is a way to get up here. Oh, I can at least... Oh wait, I got it. Maybe I can... Hop on top of the vase. You would think you could because it's a flat surface, but you can't. You gotta probably come back with the ice and then get up there that way. Or maybe you can just hop around the corner. Never mind. Never mind. There's, I'm trying to think of some other, uh, oh yeah, some PS2 games would be nice too. I think you could play like Dark Cloud 2, which is great, but, yeah, there's some goofy choice. Like Shadow Hearts, like, I think that's what we were talking about, like, let me play that, damn. Any game that's rare, basically, let me play it. Uh... Oh. Oh, oh, there it is. There you go. Oh my god, look at his feet. Hey, They're there, horrifying. Lady. Thanks for helping out. Anytime, Farmer Bill. Oh my god, look at his feet. Here, take this thing, Majig. I was gonna use it in my new smoker BBQ for flavor. BBQ? <laughs> hey, it's Fiona. Wow, it sure is. It sure is Fiona. I wonder what's in here. I bet it's a speedway. I'm dreading it. I'm fucking dreading it. But I know it's there. What if it's just stuck? Yeah, it just sits there and just spins around forever. Loading, please wait. So much loading. <laughs> Wait, I left? No, I didn't want to leave. Or did I? Mm. We all want to leave. But we can't. Not until the business is done. How are you enjoying the game so far? I hope you're loving it. I hope it's everything you've ever wanted and more. Oh, God. Let's just... Yeah, 
and these levels aren't very big either. Which I don't mind. I, I don't want them to be super long. I guess hitting those two does absolutely nothing. Oh, yeah. Let's get that platform back down. Actually, I blew up something. Like, that should have made it to where I can... Uh... Go back around. Let me... Let me check real quick. Because I would hate to... Go back around for no reason. Did it not? Do I have to? I thought I... I thought this blew up. Okay, I do have to go back. Alright, that's fine. Oh, I totally missed this part. What is this? This... Okay, yeah, I, I did do this. Did I, what a... I'm missing more dragonflies from this. Where? Is I supposed to do something with the tractors? I must have missed it if I if he did tell me like am I supposed to yeah, bubble up no. uh -huh. I could have sworn I remember there being like a a UFO mini game or something in this part, but did I imagine it all? Oh, there's there's part of it. Oh, yep, yep, okay. Well, there's one of the gems. I just gotta find the last one. Wherever the hell it's at. How'd I miss this part? It's sparkling around. This is the the UFO part. Spyro, oh, I'm no. glad you're here. I just knew there was something suspicious about this farm. Space cows are everywhere, and now a big UFO is coming to abduct Farmer Dill's cows. There's a prototype tractor beam on this UFO that you can use to beam up the cows and put them into the corral. How does Farmer Don have a UFO? Dill needs your help. Well, yeah, how does he have a UFO? With the prototype UFO? Hmm. How do I fly that thing? Press the A button when you are over a cow to use the beam. Press X to shoot UFOs. Hold B to fly faster. Yeah. You, you better hurry here. Uh-oh. I just remember this part being so ass. Oh god. Uh oh there it is. One of the cows is being abducted. Oh, there he is. Give me that cow. Oh god, this this controls terribly. Being abducted. <laughs> Never mind. This might be one of the worst. Uh... Let me. Oh my god, stop picking him up. It's mine.
if you don't pick him up, he's just going to come back for him. Oh, God. Come on. And he's... No. Stop trying to pick up the cow. This part's not that bad, honestly. Was that just a really stupid kid back then? I don't think I had any troubles with it. I think I just hated this part. Oh my god. He's mine. Get out of here. And dropped. Cool, I did it. That was awesome, Spyro. You saved all the cows. By the way, I found this dragonfly hiding in the barn. Here you go. Hunter, just give me the dragonflies when you find them. <laughs> jingles. Hey it's, jingles. hey, it's Jingles. Wow. You'll call them Jingles, huh? All right. Did you see that? Farmer Dill forgot to lock the gate and the cows got out. And it looks like there's more UFOs this time. Do you think you're up for another run? Farmer Dill needs your... Watch out. Of course. I didn't see what it said about the gold UFOs, but... Oh, God. Oh, my God. Maybe this is what it was. It was like where he said, we got to do it again. And it's like, I don't, I don't want to do this. It's like, man, you look at this game and then you look at like what you could get. And like, ah, oh, I could just get anything else. Like Ratchet and Clank, I think, came around this time too. Imagine getting this and not Ratchet and Clank. What a sad, sad Christmas morning you had. Getting this. <laughs> oh my god, just give me the damn cow. Stop shooting me. This game is having a hard time with the UFO physics. Alright, give me this. Drop this son of a bitch in. Good. Well, it wasn't hard, so cool. that's fine. You did it again. I did. Take my pet as my thanks. Make sure Why do you have a pet dragonfly? She just loves them. Dude, I don't think they understood what they were doing. J dubs? What? Do you want to take a spin in the pro? No. Thanks. No, I I don't. I don't want to do that. I don't want to take a spin. No, thank you. I'm good. I am very good on that. Absolutely fucking not. Ah. <laughs> uh. To the next one. I'm already like a fourth through the game and I've only been playing it for a couple of hours. That's. Uh. Where is this last gem at? I thought 
thought it would have been just over here by the barn or something, but... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Spyro skating again. He's not supposed to do that. There we go. Uh, just... Man. Man, oh man. What? What other thing do you have to do in this level? Because there's two more and I'm missing a gem. What else could it... What else could it be? It's just one. I bet it's somewhere that just isn't loading correctly. That wouldn't surprise me. They're like, oh yeah, it's uh, over here. They're like, did I forget to kill an enemy? something in the trees like there's the glowy shit around it but I don't know if this means anything or if it just it just glows mm. there must be something I'm missing or I bet it's like a some Mini mini game hell hole. That got me to leave, I'm pretty sure. So what uh do I do? Okay, so what did he want? Ugh. Um the UFO that took the cows is back. I was gonna see my what cows. What can I do to help? Leave. Just in case they come back, but we don't have any way to power them. Maybe you can help us power them with your lightning breath. Okay, so I didn't know that that was gonna be a thing. Oh, cool. And I'm dead. Oh, well, thanks for coming to the stream. Sorry that you you left, but I get it. Oh. All right. Well, now I know what to do. I gotta use the lightning breath on the cannons, which. I didn't know that uh, was going to happen, but that's fine. It's whatever. Oh my god, he's talking and nothing was coming out. That was so weird. Okay, I think one of the... Sounds like that fucking Tim Allen thing. Or... <laughs> Blast him. He's gonna try to shoot me. Is it. Did it. Did it do it? I, I guess it did it. That didn't look like it did it, but. I guess it counts. Sure, we'll, we'll take it, I guess. Is it down here? Where is this last gem? You you don't have the the pointer thing like uh, the other one. Oh, well, maybe it's like. No, and I thought the directional pad maybe had something, but 
No. Weird. Well, that sucks. <laughs> Maybe I'll randomly find it, but I doubt it. Also, what does the farmer want over here? What are you wanting? Thanks for freeing the. You think you can get them and move them back here? How do you move them? Do you have to? Okay, you just gotta zap them. Okay. Yeah, sure. I guess I can. Oh, come on. Okay, you gotta wait until they sit down with the farmer and listen to us. Go. Go. Faster. Imagine just minding your own business and then getting fucking shocked by a a dragon. The cows did nothing wrong. And you're just shocking them. For your own sick amusement. Okay, is that all of them? Uh oh. Oh, that was... This is weird. He's not moving. He's stuck. Oh, no. The buttons work. Oh, my God. This game might break me. What the fuck? <laughs> what the actual fuck is wrong with this game? I mean, it's busted, but damn. It's like... Imagine going... You know, I, as much as I got pissed off at Year of the Dragon, like when it wasn't the mini games, it was really fine, but... I didn't realize how bad it could get. I might have goofed on doing this. Okay, let me... Let me go back. I gotta do that again, I guess, because... The game just decided to just... If you try to talk to the NPCs too fast... Or if you're, like, near something... You'll just get stuck. That happened with the the lightning thing too. You just got stuck. And then it's just like, yeah, fuck you. You're done. Man, I gotta do it again. That's fine. I will. Fine. Gotta talk to him again. Yep. Tell me. Oh my god. Just. And then. Same. I gotta save the cows himself. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Okay, so. And then the thing disappeared, so. It's like, where is this? This last stupid gem. Where is it? Oh my god, I might have to look up how to. Is there like a. Nope. Nope, I thought there would be. Here we go. Help. Okay. Oh, dear God. Is 
There isn't. There isn't a way. I'm, I'm never gonna find it. How's everyone hanging in there? This was probably someone's favorite game. Kudos to them. Like, yeah, it's, it's really not that bad of a game. It's just really buggy. I really think that if, if they could have gotten the bugs worked out and also if the levels would make more sense, it just seems like shit just... Like, they kind of just said fuck it to whatever the hell uh, level structure was going on like this one here where the objectives are just kind of at random it seemed and then sometimes it just doesn't fucking work maybe it just carries over but go All right, this time I hope I don't get stuck on them. Okay, I got them. Way to go, Spyro! Way to go, Spyro! By the way, while you were out looking for cows, I found this here critter, and I think it may belong to you. <laughs> Just sounds like Aaron Hansen. It's so funny to me. <laughs> oh. Hey, it's Cedric. Wow. I can't believe I found Cedric the Entertainer. Awesome. He was in a horror movie with Ethan Hawke and Amanda Seyfried called First Reformed. I had never seen this man be in something serious before. And uh, the Cedric, I've never seen him in something serious before, but the <laughs> I was fucking blown away by how good he was in it. Like, I don't think he, like, he's bad by any means, but I just didn't think he had the range. And honestly, anytime anyone does a horror film, I always just have props for them. Like, if it's something really shitty, then it's like, all right, well, whatever. I had a cash in. But if, they, if they're in an, a genuinely good movie, horror movie it's like yeah hell yeah i hope you actually like horror films because yeah that, that movie was fucked up but i highly recommend it it's very good and also really depressing i found it from uh i mean it's an a24 film so it's not exactly obscure but i found it because of a letterbox list it was uh the world is hell list there's like a thousand movies on it but oh my god some of the movies that are on that list my god apparently i had watched a bunch of them already which my friends were like i don't think that's a good thing uh and like, I watched it, one of them called uh, Streetwise. It's about these kids in the 80s in Seattle that were homeless. Holy fuck, man. I didn't think I could get more depressed, but it did it. Just watching these kids just have to go through, like, prostitution and like, stealing and all this shit. And it's like 14 should not be doing this i felt so and, and you know like when you find out later on that the kids died and shit too it's insane but anyway that's really depressing for a fucking spyro game but i found that last gem it popped up 
that is a terrible sound effect. That's the most gems, though, in a level so far in Spyro, is 800. Thanks for zapping me. Okay, I should 100% it now, though. Shouldn't be too bad. I'm mad that I couldn't do it for the other one, but I just gotta get the... Oh. The ice breath. Kaboom. Did it, did it blow up? I guess it... There it is. <gasps> Alright, let's get him. It's Flavy. Hey, it's Bobby. Flavy. <laughs> Flavy? Level complete. It's... This level complete sound sounds like... Like stock. Like they didn't have enough money to make their own sound effects, so they just went, that's the one we're going to use. It sounds like something you would find in a uh, educational game from a cereal box or like jumpstart or something does not sound like it's from a spyro game <laughs> i mean but then again i mean you know you have to use like stock sound effects here and there anyway but that one just sounds cheap that sounds like a we found a a thousand sound effects cd here's one great we'll use it the game comes out tomorrow and two loading screens, though? Really? Two? Two. It's two too many. I have 25. Oh, that means I can go to the, the next place, but I don't have... <laughs> I love this guy. What is he? What is that? Look at his little hat. He's, he's cool. He can stay. He can be in the next Spyro game. I'll allow it. I'm almost... I'm almost done? What? I gotta look at that again. 29%? Really? Really? Wow. Uh-oh. Oh, should I talk to him? Hello, Spyro. You need to collect with all the hillbillies in this game. Bugs, and I should have this honeycomb raft working like a charm. Well, that should do it, Spyro. Hop. <laughs> 45? Oh my god. That one's from Louisiana. So you got Florida, Louisiana. <laughs> Were they just inspired by the South? This feels really out of place for Spyro. So, ugh. Alright. Boinkers or whatever your name was. Yay! You got enough dragonflies to get the boat up and running. Hop aboard. All right, let's go. Wait, oh, I thought that was Excalibur. <laughs> I thought it was gonna have to pull a sword out or something. Guess not. Oh, remember, if you made it this far into the the stream viewing, and if you haven't subscribed yet, you should. Why not? You know, it's just one more person. It's not going to hurt you. It's appreciated, too. Where are we going now? We're doing our first water level. Ooh. Going to the beach. This looks like hell. Oh, that's an enemy that was in, uh... Two? Yeah, there's two. Oh. Is that even an is that even an enemy? What the fuck is this? Oh, well. It sounds like the bonk horny uh meme. The doo sound. Gotta talk about stock sound effects too. Oh yeah, duh, just charge him. Uh Uh, enter the dragonfly. A game I never thought I 
would ever, ever come back to. And here I am, trying my best to do something that I didn't even dare to do as a child. God. be insane to 100% <laughs> just about every single Spyro game. I don't think I'm going to do that, but I'm at least going to play them all. I don't see why not at this point. I think I could suffer through them. I, it wouldn't really be that bad, though. I'm having fun with it still. Let me get this. Oh. I wish I could flame the dragonfly, though. Is the dinosaur friend or foe? Because they're normally foes. <laughs> hey, it's Gary. <laughs> it sounds like SpongeBob. It's Gary. Oh, God. Gare Bear. Oh, I thought he was a friend. He was just on vacation. Uh, how did he end up in... there? What is that? Is that... Oh, I have no idea what that is, but alright. Thank you so much, Spyro. I just couldn't have handled being eaten for dinner. No problem. What I'll is keep that a voice? nose out for your friends. I think I can smell them roasting off in the distance. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm not kidding. I can smell them. They smell delicious. I will consume your friends. Yeah. No, it was a different. It wasn't that one. The the bonk. It's that guy. He sounds like it. Let me. Yowch. Oh my god. They, they really did not need to have it to where he says yowch every single time he hits his head. Yeah, see? That's the fucking sound effect. Doo. The bonk horny meme. That is definitely it. Fuck. Can I... No, no, I can't climb that stuff. Come on, what am I thinking here? It's Spyro. He still controls these. Like, look how big these levels are with nothing in them. I don't want to hurt the dragon, though. He's just on vacation. Let him be. And you gotta You gotta be close to those gems too Because if not Like you have to be real up close and personal Did one of them fall in the fucking sand? Okay cool I got it If that would have glitched to the floor I think it would have just exploded There's there's nothing here. Oh wait, hold up. Maybe there is. Okay, cool. I'm glad I didn't turn around. So many gems here. I thought I heard a dragonfly, but I guess... Oh, it's those guys. Oh wait, hold up. you on the island but I didn't believe it you gotta help me that's Billy Although West keeps calling me ham sandwich and asking me if I'd go better with mustard and mayonnaise it sounds like fry that's definitely Billy West like there is no denying that if not it is someone who can do a really good Billy West impression but that is that is him 
has to be. Okay, here we go. Jumping, yay. You got to me before the Riptox could. Yeah, because it just sounds like a combination of the professor and, uh, yeah, and Fry. Let me open it. What did it open? Great. Another one. Ah, ah, cool. Well, hey. I didn't have that, so. Oh, and I didn't even get the rest of. Man, I gotta go back. I don't even know how I missed that. That didn't even make sense. I guess my brain was kind of broke doing that one. Oh, thank you. Yay! No, wait, wait. I gotta actually collect it. The sparks get upgraded at some point because you spoiled me in the other one. Uh huh. And then you can hear it. Uh, yeah, you can definitely hear it. Oh, I swear I could hear a sausage grinder calling my no name. No problem. Saving pigs on vacation is what I was born to do. <laughs> yeah, you know, I feel like Spyro should be a little pissed off at saving people. He's like, I didn't want to fucking do this. Why do I have to do this? Like, I'm... Spyro, you have to do it. All these elder dragons are like, nah, you, he has to do it. It's like, why the, f why the fuck do I have to do everything? I don't want to do this. Typical old people. Try to get the young to do it all for them. Bunch of bastards. Alright. Come on, Spyro. You can do this. Alright, this time I'm not gonna fuck up the jump. Dude, what the fuck? Alright, it just straight up glitches out when you try- Hold on, did I miss a gym up there too? There's one right here. And there was a guy. Alright, try it again. Fucking hell. The camera keeps- diving in for some reason. I don't know why. God. Unbelievable. Come on, Spyro. Come on. Come on. There he goes. Go. <laughs> oh, some of this stuff is so rough. Okay. Yeah, every time I try to jump, yeah, it glitches through the floor. What? Can I just go around? You know what? I'll, I'll just come back to it. I hate those pigs. I hate the pigs so much. Oh, he has, like, a hot dog with him. <laughs> that shouldn't make me laugh, but it's... Oh my god, it's certain sound effects now. It's, like, my brain is just melted. It's that one in the... The metal pipe sound. I don't know what it is, but it fucking cracks me up every single time, because it's so stupid. Why does this... 
exist. What a dumbass sound effect. What's down here? Should I be down here? Oh, yeah. So I got a. God, that's a huge ass invisible wall. Just let me in. Let me get the gems. Sparks, pick up the gems. You're just not as good as you're the dragon, Sparks. People are saying that this game should get remade, and um, I don't know about that. I just don't think so. I mean, I, I guess if they fixed the game and made it what it should have been, but the problem with remaking old games that kind of sucked is that people are going to be like, why would they remake that? It was terrible. Like, the general public is going to be like, oh, it's shit. You'd have to somehow really convince people that no, no, this time it's not shit. But then... If it turns out to be shit, people are going to go, Well, yeah, it was shit the last time. Why would it be good this time? Like, oh, they prettied it up? Great, it's a prettied up turd. I just wouldn't... I just would not trust a process like that. I'm like, no, oh, it's... Hold on, hold on, and... Uh, yeah, my brain is the size of fucking peanut. Yeah, I can't open that yet. God, his climbing is so weird. At least it's faster. But yeah, this... It, just, it feels like it feels like you got a store brand soda instead of like Coke or Pepsi, or, you know, like or Dr Pepper. It's like you got uh, like Dr Thunder. It's like it's not horrendous, but it tastes different. It's only gonna be funny to me, and that's that's fine. Uh. Oh, okay. We're just not even gonna give an animation for that one. It just disappears. Get me out of here! Hello, the gate's open. Oh, huh? it is. Oh well, what do you know? Look at that, silly me. Thanks for saving me. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Hey, it's Gip. <laughs> oh my god, I would have been driven insane to... Hey, it's this one. Hey, it's this one. Hey, it's Scuttlebutt. Scuttlebutt? Scuttlebutt. You're gonna tell me that this motherfucker's name is Scuttlebutt. Scuttlebutt? What kind of fucking name is Scuttlebutt? Whatever. Have your have your fucking dumbass names. I didn't want to be in Spyro anyway. It's the one request I would ever have. If you do make a new Spyro game, can I just be like, just one line? That's all I want. Is this, is this on watermelons? Yay. Open her up. Bubble him in. Hey, it's Plato. <laughs> Yay, Plato. Oh my god, dude, my stomach. I hope that's not picking up, but like my stomach keeps like just ugh. Grumbling or something, but Ugh. 
Okay, was there something down here? Oh, wait. Hold up. There's a gem right there. Beautiful. Okay, I was thinking you had to, like, run through these or something, but... Nope. How many have we gotten so far? 600... 900?! Oh my... How many gems are all together? Seven thousand. Huh, I mean, that's not that bad. I guess they. <laughs> I guess they just decided, like, yeah, we'll just put all the. We'll put all the gems in the front, and then at the end, we're just like, yeah, whatever. Just finish the stupid level. Ah, yeah, ouch. Oh. ouch. That's the way to leave. Right. Pretty sure that's the way to leave. Okay. What, uh, I wonder what this one is. Come on, Spyro. We have to. We have to do this. We have to win. We have to beat this. Oh God! Please don't tell me this is like a rhythm game. Oh God! It is. Hello, Spyro. Unga. We Tiki getting ready for big Tiki Tours Luau. Unga. We teach tourists how to play drums. Tiki 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 style. Tiki Tiki Unga Boom. Ha 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 Tiki Tiki Lolo. Come now. Me Tiki see Spyro has want to play drums before tourists get here. Unga. Go play. Drums are placed like buttons on controller. The B button is for left drum. The X button for right drum. The Y button for top drum. Okay. Come now. Uga. Cool. Oh my god. I wish it would just complete. Okay. Alright, let's do it. Ready? Here goes. <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh. I was really hoping maybe we would just glitch onto the one guy and to just be him over and over. I did it! Yay! Now give me the dragonfly. <laughs> Spyro best drummer! Unga bonga hula ma ale a a! Have prize for Spyro! It's. Terrell. Hey, it's Terrell! Terrell? Spyro good drummer already, but are you big drumming champion? Let's find out. Oh, God. Yeah, let's do it again. Ready? Yep, here goes. This is just going to be the same thing again. Oh, 
Oh, you kind of have to like play it fast though too. One, two, three. It just sounds like shit. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was like, I don't think I can remember one more thing on top of that. Sorry, man. Unga bunga. No, thank you. Good on that. Very good on that. I didn't want to fuck it up, so I'm sorry that I didn't talk a whole lot for that, but... God, God damn. Just awful. Awful. Ah, oh, terrible, terrible mini games. Pretty standard stuff, though, but... Oh, no, thank you. I'm good. The loading times are definitely excruciating, though. Um, <laughs> it just takes so long to get into the damn... Uh-oh. Oh, Spyro's busted again. Uh-oh. And now he's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, so how many uh, how many gems am I missing from here? Over two hundred still. What? How? That doesn't make any sense. I mean, there's like a whole part though that I straight up. Straight up busted and will not let me in. That's the exit. I wish it said exit or something because I kind of looked at it just being like, oh, I guess I should go that way. And then you realize that you don't go that way. Maybe there's like a whole section I'm missing that's down here. Somewhere. Or not. Oh, there's one gym that I was missing. <laughs> the, uh... Yeah, the spark system doesn't work very well in this one. Like, you'll just... You'll hit an enemy and you won't get the gym because the gym fell off somewhere. It just fell off the side of the level. I missed this part too. I don't even think I actually hit that. Yeah, see, like, if it was Insomniac, the you would have hit him, and then it would have picked up the gym. You have to wait, and then look around and see if it dropped the gem. It definitely takes away from the the fluidity of it. Oh, that's just a straight up section I missed. God, I don't know if I hit this enemy already. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Who knows? 
Wait, wasn't I already here? I got like totally turned around, didn't I? I did. Yeah, yeah, I did. My bad. I thought maybe I stumbled on a part of the, the level that I hadn't done. God, now I'm just looking through and seeing, making sure I didn't miss anything, but yeah, I got it all. Oh. Bunga bunga. Oh, there's a level right there, too. How'd I miss that? Let's, uh, let's see if we can let's see if we can pop this bad boy open. Yeah, there's a bunch of stuff over there. Let's 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 hop over there and get it open. I hate the sounds that the stupid dragons make though. just feels so off. <laughs> it's gonna make me laugh every fucking time of all the sound effects it could have been. It had to be that one. Oh. Got him. Hey, it's Daisy. It is, I guess. I'll stop it off in the head. Another life, huh? I stopped myself. I bet this is a speedway. We haven't seen one in a while. Actually, I'm very sure because this is what came up the last time. I'm not ready to do one of these again. They're so bad. Hey Spyro, oh, no. I was out here checking out my baby manta ray farm and those stupid rip talks have scared them all away. Let's race to see who can capture more of them before time runs out. Capture the baby manta rays? How do I capture them? Press B button to make the mana ray swim faster. Cap. I guess. That's not a mana ray. That is, though. Oh my god. Uh Okay, there we go. Every time Hunter wants to do something, I'm instantly like, uh, You want to do that? Why? This is, this is, this is awful. <laughs> oh my god, you have to like, oh god. Alright, I'm whooping Hunter's ass, so it doesn't matter. Are we done? Cowabunga, dude. I did. And you had another fuck, just. Hey, it's Krishna Murdy. <laughs> You're telling me that that's a character? Want to try capturing them again? No. All right. Why would I want to do that again? No.
Absolutely not. If I don't have to do it, I'm not going to. You have a lot of faith in your mini games to think that I'm going to want to just play them nonstop. Then again, it's for children. So maybe some kid thinks that that level's so fun. Yay, I love capturing the thing. No, it's busted. I'm going to beat it, but it's not as bad as the race, though. That race was awful. So bad. I hate all the enemies go back to. Come on. That's not a way to go. Did I? No, no, I made. I... Uh, okay. I definitely. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm trying to argue with a game that's. Just. <laughs> it doesn't work most of the time. Like, I can't. I can't fault the game. It's not its fault that it's broken. God. I'm gonna try again. Try again to get up there, because shit is borked. You try to go up there? Yep. Uh -huh. It's so long to get up there, too. And then, yeah, you try to go up here. And then... Yeah, the fucking camera freaks the fuck out. Come on, camera. Come on. Come on. What the fuck? Yeah, it just glitches you through the floor. It's worse than I thought. I'm going to look back at it again. It's like, oh, okay, yeah, it seems fine. And then you jump. And then... I, yeah, I try to get the camera around. Yeah, and then it just glitches you through the floor. Wow. <laughs> Alright, so I'm not going crazy. It just... Sucks. <laughs> it sucks. <laughs> Oh god, come on. I'm gonna chop. Maybe it's the emulator, maybe it's the game. I think it might be the game, though. I'm starting to think this game might be a little bad. Uh, you have. You cannot jump off the edge of that plat. You, yeah, you can't jump off the plat. Oh my god, that whole section's borked. Oh my god. Okay, so yeah, you gotta, you gotta not jump off the edge, which is what I've been doing the entire time in all of the Spyro games, and that's been working fine. But for this game, no, 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 don't do it. At least for me, I'm not gonna get to do it. If it was, uh, Did I... How many do I have from here? Eight. Okay, so there's... I don't know what the other two would be. I mean, there's one below me, obviously, because I gotta... unlock him. I thought he was just gonna go down there like Spyro. Do not. Don't you even consider going down there yet. Uh, I was about to say, it's like, are we gonna even bother to tell me what the hell I'm doing? Oh, cool. Uh, 
this might not work either. Awesome. That might be my fault though. Oh my god. I gotta go all the way back. All the way back. Oh my god. Hey, it's Socrates. Oh no. <laughs> I think I played this game more than I ever did as a kid. Did I really just like turn it on and just fucking shut it off? I guess I just didn't want to play it. Or maybe it did. I, I mean, how the fuck am I supposed to remember 20 years ago? Random game that I played. All I remember was that this game bad. I also went too far with like uh, like critic reviews and shit. I would just take everything they did as gospel. You know, like, oh man, if they said it's a bad game, then I'm not going to play it. And then I, uh, now I realize that, uh, dude, those game reviewers, they don't know how to play the fucking game. <laughs> and also, you know, like, you might get somebody who doesn't even like these kind of games. It's like, well, yeah, of course the guy who loves playing Call of Duty doesn't like playing Spyro. I mean, it makes sense, I guess, but... Oh, <laughs> awesome. That, that didn't make any sense. <laughs> this isn't a hard part. I just want to stress that. It's straight up busted. The character just goes straight to the fucking floor. Yeah, you just go straight to the floor and you're just... This time I did it. Oh, you know what? <laughs> and there's not even like a like, oh you got you went through the special uh loop de hoop. Now you can do the thing. It's like no, they just they just gave up. Huh, what other gems am I missing? Eleven. Oh my god. What the actual fuck? Okay. Come on. Forget to hit triangle. I wish there was another way to get up there. But there isn't. You really have to. This is a nightmare. I'm gonna beat it though. I'm gonna beat this stupid fucking game once and for all. I wish these drag. <laughs> There's not even like an animation for them, they just poof. Is he supposed. To oh wait, no, because that wouldn't make any sense because this is the last dragonfly I need. If this section wasn't so borked here it would probably be fine there we go oh, oh the camera doesn't want to focus on the objective at hand uh Okay, so you gotta wait until the stupid power stops. And then you can bubble them. Bubble them. There we go. Hey, it's Homer. Merge! Alright, we got all of them there. 
Wait, is that... Is that a gem down there? Oh, it looked like it. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm missing a f just 11 fucking gems. 11? I wish he, uh... Could tell me where they were at. That would be awesome. That wasn't a feature that needed to be next from from this one, you know. Like they could have, they could have just kept it. I would have been okay with that. But no. Man, am I just gonna have? I'm just gonna have to fucking look around. I don't wanna <laughs> look around. Scouring every surface I can. So maybe, just maybe. My lights are flickering. I hope there's not a storm that's about to happen. Every time it every time it storms, I'm just like, yep, there goes my power. And I already I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna kill every enemy that's up there. Bubble them. And then. If it was a crap ton of them, then I would have been like, ah, it's fine. But it's a couple. I'm like, oh. I'm like, I could find them then. Try to find them. I'm like, they have to be here somewhere. Just where? And I don't have the shield thing that they're talking about yet. There's not even like a little sparkle thing for when they di when they die. It just they just put gone. Nothing in here. All the enemies are dead. At least up there. I'll get the other ones too. And I have looked around. Oh my god. the worst part about these kind of games. You get so gung-ho about, oh, I'm collecting all of them, yay, yay, and then when you miss one, you're like, but how? How did I miss one? That's impossible. It can't be. But no, you did. What have you done? Yeah, see, you kill that guy, nothing happens. He gets stuck in the wall. Oh, I thought. No, oh, oh, no, oh, come on, camera. stopped. <laughs> oh, there it is. That was weird. Game gets really eerie 
Having no music playing. Just nothing. You want to hear something too fucking bad, you get nothing. No music. <sighs> Where else? Where else would it be? You try to drown yourself. Sit in the bush. This game hurts me. I'm not going back that way. I already went that way. I already went up there. And nothing. Nothing is there. I'm missing 11 gems. I guess I'll kill these guys too. hit my head into that already so where could it be how's this game going <laughs> i was wondering if you'd show uh, if you'd show up oh it's honestly hasn't really been that bad there's been some glitches you missed out on the racing thing if you thought the racing was bad in the other ones if you don't hit all of the uh the stars to make yourself go faster you straight up cannot win it is impossible and the game gets glitched out so it just becomes impossible to win it's so bullshit oh there there's one so where's the other also i'm missing like one gem here it had to be one gem But so far, I've gotten 35 of the dragonflies. That's the main collectible in it. And we are... Uh, 40... I cannot believe this. 40% of the way already through the game. I think if I beelined it, we'd be done pretty quickly. But I'm, I'm getting everything that I can. If it can be done... I'm going to do it. But yeah, the... <laughs> it's very jank. The cutscenes look really bad. Yeah, I played it when it did came out. Uh, I got it for Christmas, and it's... Terrible. It's not terrible. I'm being hyperbolic there. It's not... It's not the worst game ever made. But it's not good. It it feels... It definitely... You can tell that a different developer made this. It just doesn't feel correct. Everything feels slightly off. Also, just from... Oh my god. Yeah, the music I was playing. That might be an emulator thing, but... No, it's fine. You can, you can be late. Hey, as long as you're here, you're not late. Also, you can always go back and check out the the beginning of the stream, too. So, to see, uh, to see what you missed. So, if you want to check out, like, uh, all the good stuff and all that, you can. Well, all the bad stuff. Uh, you missed the... Honestly, you missed the technical glitches that I was having, too. I was having a hard time capturing the game. I figured it out, but... Yeah. That was... That was a huge pain in the ass. I straight up don't know where this is. There's one... Measly... Little... Gem... That I am missing. And I cannot find it. And you cannot sparks this one. At least I don't think you can. Like, I'm going to check right now. Engine the dragonfly. 
Sparks. Hints. Are you kidding me? I was watching another game. It's interesting. What was the other game? And you watched a different streamer too. Oh, how could you? No, nah, it's fine. So to get the gem finder ability, you have to beat the game. And then you get it. That is... That's a crock of bullshit. <laughs> Just give me the stupid ability now. I saw a fan-made remaster of this game done in Reignited's engine. Ooh. I wonder if I could actually play that. Yeah, no, that would be cool. Stranger the game. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, because I saw that people are were doing uh, mods for Enter the Dragonfly, where they were going to do like an HD texture pack and um, fix a lot of the glitches and stuff. But yeah, I didn't know someone was doing it in the Reignited engine, though. That's really cool. I'll have to check that out. Oh. Okay, well, I have ice powers now. I think. I keep forgetting that there's like a... Oh, I can go get that. Oh. But yeah, no. Um... It's called At Dead of Night. Okay, yeah, I'll definitely have to check that out. Actually, I can... I'll do it right now. Spyro at... Oh. Oh. Never mind. I guess it's not gonna... There is a huge storm coming. All right, well, if the dead of night. Oh. Oh, you're talking about the game that you watched. It was called at Dead at Night. Hmm. I might have to check this game out. I feel like I could probably stream it. The last horror game that I streamed was uh, Close to the Sun, I think. I guess that's a horror game, but wasn't wasn't very good. But I did play one called In Sound Mind. Uh, I know that a lot of the big streamer dudes uh, played it and I really liked it it was a really fun game really sad too definitely uh, definitely depressing but worth it detention was a good one too and I streamed that and I also played uh, devotion which is done by the same people though I kind of messed up making the video because I accidentally blocked some of the subtitles so Oops. But, yeah, no one really checked it out, which is fine. I get it. I don't have a whole lot of pull. But yeah, definitely check those streams out, too. They're really good. Oh, now we have Wing Shield. Cool. Oh, I gotta go talk to Sleepy Bear now. 
This is a sleepy guy. Is there anything up here? No. So yeah, in this one, uh, yeah, yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if it was. Like, he looks very similar to, like, the PS1 era. Hooray! You did it! The swirly thingy is working! Step right in, and it will take you up, up to the clouds. Try not to get dizzy. I did and almost lost my ham and sheep sandwich. Ha! Sheep? Did I say that? The animation in this game, too, is really bad. Some of the characters look f downright frightening. Like, Hunter looks awful. Bianca's character model looks bad. Very early 2000s design. Like we gotta make her wear like a little little dress and stuff. It's like, oh god, please no. No, we don't need this. Where the fuck am I now? Oh, I'm just in the clouds. Is this a whole level or... I am almost to the end of the game. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> well, I mean, then again, the other games aren't exactly long either. But, like, I'm not even really trying. I know you hated Hunter and... Hey, yeah, yeah, and he holds you... He's holding out on everything, too. The machines powering our hourglass. Oh, no. Your electric breath would be perfect for powering the machines. No one around here can get any sleep. Can you help us? No one gets any sleep at this place, too. Case in point, Riotic. Yeah. Yeah, I hate Hunter. He's an idiot. He's so stupid. But yeah, the characters don't act right in this game. And, uh, yeah, it just feels like someone was told, hey, this is what a Spyro game is, and then they forgot what they were told, and they're like, well, you have to go off of what you can remember, and then they made that. Like, for some reason, Ripto's back, but they don't really give, like, a good reason for it. He's just like, hey, I'm back, and I'm mad as hell. Because, like... Yeah, it's still Tom Kenny. Yeah. Yeah, he definitely has a little more SpongeBob y sound to him in this one. And I think Billy West is in this game too. And he plays some like the side character people. He's the one that plays like Fry and uh Futurama and tons of other things too. Like he's in Ren and Stimpy and a lot of things. He's he's just as big as Tom Kenny. I mean, I would say he's even bigger than Tom Kenny, but but yeah, I think we. I think in the next game he changes voices and it's it's drastic. You definitely notice it. <laughs> You know what? I'm gonna. Oh god. Oh yeah, I'm glad I went down here because there's a bunch of stuff. But yeah, I'm playing an, an emulated version of the game, so it runs a lot better. And if, you, if I were to just play it natively, I tried to. It runs at like 20 frames, and it looks so bad. But with this, with like the filtering and everything on it, so much better. I'm really hoping my power doesn't cut out either. Because every time it storms, the power goes out. Doesn't voice one of the biggest cartoons ever. 
I mean, Billy West definitely does. Like, I'd say Voice and Fry and Professor Farnsworth and Zap Brannigan, that's a pretty big role. And Ren and Stimpy was pretty big. And he also voices the Honey Nut Cheerios B. I feel like that's a pretty iconic mascot character. But yeah. Not as big as Spongebob. I, I, yeah, I guess, I don't know. I guess it would just depend on who you ask. Then again, I feel like more people know who Spongebob is than, uh, than Fry. But everyone knows what the B sounds like. What the hell is that? I got a wand. Uh, alright. I guess that's something you get is a wand. Yeah, that, that is true. Yeah, he is a pretty big character. Uh, I mean, he's also the pirate in Spongebob. Which I didn't know as a kid until looking up his IMDb and like, wait a minute. It's like, yeah, no, that's him. Also, I mean, he played a lot of voices on Spongebob. Uh, maybe that's something I should do at some point is play the Spongebob games. I don't know how well those would go down, but... But first, it's Spyro. I was also thinking of playing Super Mario Sunshine, because I never finished that game either. I feel like at some point I should also play uh, <laughs> Wind Waker or something. That's a game I always meant to finish and never did. Why is there one? Oh, I'm fighting storm clouds in the game and in real life. Awesome. So yeah, the games I'm thinking of playing would be, yeah, the Spyro games. And then... Oh. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. The Spyro games. Super Mario Sunshine. And then... Maybe the Resident Evil games? I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready to to put time in for those again. Maybe I will. I love those games. I just won't play Code Veronica because I hate that one. That is a game that no one should play. <laughs> Unless you're really into Resident Evil, then play it, but no. Turn the sleep machines on. There it goes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Spyro's pretty iconic. Yeah, to those who grew up playing them, definitely. Like you don't hear a little bit of SpongeBob in that. Like I can I can definitely tell that that's Tom Kenny. I feel like it's hard for him to hide the the SpongeBob. Spyro's. God. I'm really looking forward to uh, seeing your reaction to 
the next like, trilogy of Spyro games. Because, yeah, those are, those are weird to look at. Elijah Wood plays Spyro. Ice Boy? That's not even a name. No one would name their child Ice Boy. I hope not, at least. I wouldn't be surprised, but don't. This is such a weird fucking level. It... Man, it really doesn't flow very well. Sleepy guy. I did play Crash Bash. I played it back when it came out, but yeah, it's been a really long time. I remember having fun with it. I don't know if it holds up anymore, but I'm surprised they didn't do like a Crash Bash remake or something. Can you use your super flame breath to get? Yeah, I can. I can do that. Let me get rid of these buttholes. Yeah. Oh, that was weird that it, that was happening in my ear. <laughs> it was like, uh huh. Ouch. But yeah, I think that there should be like a Mario Party killer we need something to challenge the norm so that's challenging stuff just that's how you can breed innovation and I mean like the Super Mario Party games are better but yeah the Crash Bash would be really cool. Dude, the, the, f the gym thing does not work in this game. Come on, go, go, go. Everything is just so slightly off. Crash Team Rumble is the modern day Crash Bash. I thought it was like a... I don't know what I thought Crash Bash was, or Crash Team Rumble, or yeah, I don't know what I thought that game was because I thought it was like a like a four v four multiplayer game or something like a MOBA esque thing or something. I don't know what I was expecting it to be or what I thought it was. I don't know if it is like a mini game collection type thing. God, the camera does not work in this game. Just want to swirl it around a little bit. And. Let's see how the glass works now. No. How big is this level? I thought Crash Team Rumble was on PC as well, but apparently it's not. be down to try it or if it is I guess that I missed it but I definitely need to try it oh sleepy bear thanks for the help Spyro Danny wow thank he's so helpful thank you for telling me that <laughs> thanks for the help Spyro yep yeah, bye I guess. Oh yeah, I should play the Crash games too. That one might be a little tough though. For me. Have to do it to a certain point. Try my hardest with Crash 4.
I don't understand why they took the crash kit. Yeah, I don't either. I don't know why they took Crash's teeth out of his mouth, too, for uh, the Japan release. They just fused all of his teeth into one, like, giant tooth mouth. It looks really weird. But yeah, I would like them to try to do the, like, Spyro Crash uh, mashup thing again. That would be cool. And actually do it proper. I think it could work out really well. I mean, they kind of did it again in the Skylander stuff, but... Oh god, that camera... That camera just does not... This is not what I want to see, game. Alright, here we go. Every time it freezes a little bit, I feel like the game's going to just crash on me. And it's a spiral, not crash. It's not supposed to crash. Oh, oh no. Oh, Epic Zombie Killer, you're just in time. We're going to do a race. Man. Okay, go with the rings. Then the stars, go cards, and save the flying riptox for last. Get ready! Yay! How do I run into him or? Oh, nope. Alright, I fucked that up. Did you play those two crossover? I did when I was a kid. I don't remember any of, any of it. I remember the Spyro one being worse, though, because it was just like a minigame collection. like the main thing for uh, the Spyro Crash mash thing was people were like, well this would have been cool when the games were good and now the games are bad, but now that the games are getting better, you know, maybe maybe it could actually happen. But yeah, they did it for Skylanders as well. They had like Crash uh, Skylander and alright that was too bad oh the fucking things are freaking out again <laughs> do I want to try again no I hate those but yeah I'm planning on playing the Crash and Spyro GBA games too so those will be interesting to do it's a dragonfly Tashi. Tashi Station. Tashi Sta What the hell is Tashi Station? Which challenge would you like to play? Okay, they can hardly wait. Oh, God. Racing time. Racing. So bad. So boring. Especially in this one, there's nothing happening. You know, when the Jack and Daxter racing thing happened, 
Like that one was fine because they it was like exciting, like, oh man, you're you're gonna blow up and like do all kinds of crazy shit and here's all the weapons and stuff and this is just like fly through their wings. I hope you do it. I don't wanna do this. No one wants to do this. It's just so blah. It's boring. I think I have to do the same thing I did underneath all the race. <laughs> yeah. Well, these just don't work either. That's another thing. Like, you you should have seen it when I was doing it earlier. If you didn't hit the stars, you just won't win. It's impossible. You'd be passing people up. Wouldn't matter. You'd still lose. Like, I'm passing up two people. Doesn't matter. Yeah, it doesn't matter. You have, have to hit the stars. If you don't, you lose. Like, I'm gonna lose this one. Because I didn't know where the stars were. Which sucks. Yep, see, I didn't know that star was there. But yeah, that's like a whole thing. But yeah, if I burn it... Yeah, I just passed somebody up. I'm still in third place. <laughs> like, why am I in third place? Passed up another one. Third place still. You're just in third place. You're stuck. You have to hit every single star every single lap that you go around. If you don't, you will not win. It is impossible to win. So yeah, it's, it's pretty terrible. It's, it's fucking embarrassing how bad this is. And I missed the star again, so. Gotta do it again in the load times. Oh, they're long. They're very long. All right. So yeah, that's so stupid. Yeah, yeah, I had to look it up because I was like, oh, maybe, because I was thinking, you know, if anything, maybe it's something like an issue with the emulator, you know, like the emulation and stuff, but nope, nope. It's not an issue with the emulation. It's, it is a known issue in the game. You can pass up the people, won't matter. Oh, I was about to miss that star. Yep, passed him up. Oh, almost missed that star. Oh, and then there's a rocket, but this rocket, it's not a homing rocket. It just goes straight forward, so it's completely useless. It's, it's horrible. Yeah, and then following the red dotted line thing, it's a trap. Don't do it. Like, you have to hit the rings, but don't just only follow the ring. Or, don't follow the line. you got to follow where the stars are and make sure you get into the ring. Like, he just straight up went the wrong direction, but the game is like, nope. It's, it's really bad. Really, really bad. Oh, almost missed all of the. Yeah, look at that. Passing up people. Doesn't matter. Just doesn't matter. I I hate these. <laughs> these are really bad. These are just straight up broken. 
I'm in second place now. See, that's the only way that I could get in second place, though. Is by... Oh, and now I'm in first. But yeah, have, have to. If you don't, you will lose. But yeah, got them all and I won. Only way you can do it. But the nice thing is, there is no hunter challenge. So that's really nice. All right. Grayson. Hey, it's Grayson. Great. Got him. I don't like how Sparks blinks in this game either. His eyes are weird. Yay. At least they don't. At least they weren't too fucking hard. I say that in the next one that I'll have to do is going to be excruciating. But yeah, they're very bare bones. Just poop. Bad. Just so bad. Awful. Awful experiences. I don't wish them on my worst enemy. <laughs> do you think them reigniting the game like that? I mean, it might fix it. I mean, yeah, it would take a lot to... F it would take a lot to fix these games. Also, sometimes, like you're seeing it right... Well, you see it for a little bit, but... Spyro will stop walking. And then... Oh my god, the camera's so fucking bad. I'm not trying to be negative on this game. But... God, it's really hard not to be. When it just doesn't work. Okay, can I, uh... I gotta get over there. Yeah, just doesn't work. I mean, I would like to see this game get remade, though. To, if it if it could be like a fixed version of it, where it's not terrible, yeah, that'd be awesome. It would be nice to have course corrected Spyro games, but I I don't know if it'd be worth their time to do. I don't know if there's enough uh, people that are like, yeah this one remake it oh there's still more of those oh god I thought I was done I was wrong I was so so terribly wrong but yeah there's uh there's a lot of platformers from PS1, PS2 era that I'd like to see, like, fixed versions of. Rascal was one of them, for sure. I thought I was playing the Rugrats game that I played on PS1 back in the day, but, yeah. Apparently I heard that Universal Service. Remade made come back with a new... Yep. Yeah, no. That whole... The whole... Um development process of this game was really borked. Like, they really screwed up on it. Like, I I genuinely feel bad for the developers of this game because they, I mean, no developer wants to make a shitty game. Who wants to make a bad game? But they, they got stuck with this mess. It's a mess. It's a messy game. If they could have, if they, I wish they could have gone back and fix it or something, but yeah, it's impossible now. I hope that the, the developers of this game went on to make better games. Oh, fucking hell. The jumping doesn't work in this game either. Oh my god. I'm sorry if my stomach has been going crazy on the stream. I don't know if it's been coming up at all, 
but if it has, I'm sorry. Ouch. All the blame is on you versus. Oh, yeah, no, because they were like, oh, yeah, no, this will be easy. Just make it good. And it's like, guys, you don't. We don't have anything. It turns out it's like, oh, yeah, if you have really good developers and a good idea of what the hell to do, then you can have a pretty good game. No. No. Oh, god damn it. I didn't see if there were gems up there, too. How am I supposed to get those? I guess I just gotta go back to that high peak again and. Oh, that's not high enough. I gotta go even higher than that. How high can you go? Oh. Oh, I gotta like fly from over there and get over there. Man, that's stupid. It takes forever to get up there too, so. I don't even know where that last thing is. <sighs> yeah, and there's not even animations for when the characters die, too. It's just, they just disappear. Like, there's no little spark that comes out of them or anything. It's just dead. Yeah, they didn't know what to do with Spyro for the longest time, and then as much as people dog on it for being a kid's game, even though this is a kid's game, if it wasn't for Skylanders, like who, oh, that guy's just gone. Who knows what would have happened to Spyro. I don't think they would have even bothered uh, with like getting a Reignited Trilogy going on. It's been the one thing that, like, kept him, like, in the eye. Like, the public eye. It's like, he... He needed to be rebranded into something, and Skylanders was very profitable. It made the company billions. Um... Yeah, he does his little spin if he dies, but I haven't died too many times. I think I only died a couple. I think I fell into something and I don't remember what happened, but I don't think anything too crazy happens. Give him the wand. Thanks, Spyro. Now I can power up the swirly. Yay. Cool. That I hate that it's called the swirly. <laughs> it just sounds like I'm gonna get dunked in a toilet. Thanks, Spyro. Now I'm gonna dunk ya. Good luck. Oh fuck. I don't know, apparently I uh Oh, oh. Well let's go in that swirly, cause Yeah, also, I don't remember if he does this in the original trilogy, but if you hit something, he says Youch. Maybe that was in the original, I just don't remember it, but good god, I wish I could turn that off. Because I bumped my head so many times. Man, that... Oh, okay, we can just go up here. There's so much fog in these levels. <laughs> I guess they needed it to for draw distance because whew, I bet you the draw distance got a little 
finicky. <laughs> it just turned this game into Silent Hill. Oh man, that guy's fast. Yeah, no, the charge, like, he seems pretty normal. There's just a few things that kind of get goofed. The camera gets a little messed up here and there. And then, uh,. I mean, other than that, like, it's not, it's not the worst game. It just, the whole time I've just been like, something doesn't feel right. Sparks doesn't pick up the gems as well as he should. And then, yeah, there's some platforms that you'll just straight up glitch through. And that feels pretty horrible. I was having trouble with this section because if I jumped, Spyro would go through the bottom, but then try to jump up at the bottom of the platform. Like he would go through the platform and his head would be on the bottom of that platform and he would try to jump up and it would just cause him to hit his head and he'd just fall down. So yeah, that was very annoying too. Okay, that's all the sleep machines. Okay, now I should be able to get that uh that dragonfly. It keeps running around. God he is Oh my god, I even He's fast. dragonflies no it's not that I I didn't hate rehydrate it I just I don't know I don't have the nostalgia for the Spongebob game so it really just didn't do anything for me I just was like it's all right like it was just it was just okay I'm glad that something like that could happen, though. Because, yeah, but it's weird to see a licensed game get remade. But, oh, I got him. Hey, it's Savino. It's Savino. I can't think of any other, like, licensed game that should get remade. I think they already remade like Gold Nine. So what else is there to make that people liked? I can't. I can't think of anything. Oh, I almost fell. already been here. I need to get somewhere else. <laughs> oh my god, Sparks, just pick up the damn dragonfly. Come on. Uh or wait, maybe that is where I want to go? I don't... I don't remember. 
what do I have from here? 784. And I... Dude, I barely have any of the dragonflies. Oh, I... Are you making it... I I turned them all on. What are you talking about? I think you... Yeah, I would try it. Yeah, I don't see why not. Because, yeah, with Rehydrated, it just felt like... Yeah, this is a PS2 game. I don't know. The... Maybe I also might not have just been in like the right mindset either, because a lot of times if it's like a critically acclaimed game or something, I'm like, ah. Uh. Then I come back to it and then it's good. And it's like, yeah, okay. Why not? Where is. Okay, oh, yeah. it's like, where the fuck is Spyro? I can't see him. Turn this on, did I not? Uh, alright. That was weird. <laughs> Just sat there for a while. This level is awful. Oh my god. Where the hell am I? <laughs> I ended up going right back to the... Oh my god. Terrible level. It's so bad. I think I'm appreciating Year of the Dragon a lot more now. After playing this one because this one is stinky it's a very stinky game okay I guess I'll just go back up in here and then I don't want to go back that way because that's where I came from Oh, awesome. Cool. Just not sure how I or why I fell through the level there, but okay. And then back here. And then all the enemies come back too, and it's just. Why? Why? This is a... Hmm. But yeah, I'm excited to... Oh god, to not do that. Uh, to play, play the other Spyro games, the ones that I ignored. Because I just assumed they were going to be bad. Maybe they're good. Who knows? Maybe some people like them. Like the Legend of Spyro stuff. Could be weird. And now I'm back here again. Of course I am. Why wouldn't I be? Oh my god. Stop with the ouch. Oh, how did I miss... How did I miss those? What? How did that happen? Oops. Ah, oh, well, it's only 
two each, but still, the fact that I've missed them. Like, I think they used a lot of animations and stuff from the old Spyro games, but it's hard to tell, honestly. Oh, I know where some of them are, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. I just can't reach them. Okay, sleepy bear, I did it. Thanks for the help. Here's a dragonfly for you. Rick. Hey, it's Rick. Cool. I'm glad I could get Rick. My favorite dragonfly. It crashed. <laughs> the game crashed. So, uh, that's fun. I hope, uh, I hope all my saves there, but I'm going to leave it at that. So, well, I gotta go to bed. So, Epic Zombie Killer, thank you so much for coming by on the stream again. And also, No Blitz for coming earlier today, too. Appreciate it. And if you check out, if anyone here checks out the stream afterwards, subscribe. And you can hang out in the stream with us. Why not? But yeah, the game crashed. So I guess it's time to to hang it up. It just stopped working. It just gave up. <laughs> uh, I'm going to play it again. Uh, but hopefully all my stuff's there. <laughs> yeah, we'll see how Hero's Tale goes. But yeah, this this is... It's not horrible, but it's just very, like, it, it needs work. It definitely needed more work. But, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. I'll try to stream tomorrow, too. I'll try, I try to stream every day. Just because I feel like it's a lot more fun to stream it than to just record a video and throw it up on YouTube. So, all right. I'll see you guys later. Bye.